Hello, everyone! Welcome back to another Pokemon stream. The tweet has been sent, and the gaming shall commence. I am hearing myself speak. Okay, I didn't have desktop audio on, so there was no loop. That's good, at least. Alright. This is really cool, actually. Also, hello, Edwin, if you are in chat. I saw you in the pre-chat. It's a nice... Earth. Thaum... Thaumaturge Slit? Did you change your name? Did you used to be Edwin? Or am I tripping? Uh, nice to have you here, anyways. It's cool that they changed up, like, the main menu here. But let's get gaming. Everyone's like, hey, yo, you're a weirdo from the sky. Uh, you're probably evil and connected to this. Even though we don't really have much of a reason to believe that to be the case. Got the Mountain Dew to help fuel me. I've been up since 2 a.m. So... Uh, they said go talk to the, the little boy with the big hat. So that's what we're going to do. Now that I got Braviary, I'm definitely going to be keeping my eyes out for shinies at all all times, pretty much. Pull the stream up on my phone. Let's get going. If I can remember how to fly this thing. It's so tempting to... I mean, this one's shiny, so it's got, like, a rare material in it, which means it's, it's worth to, to detour. Thank you, shiny Gyarados. This one is also shiny. <laughs> I cannot help myself. Alright, give me the hell out of here. I have seen videos comparing the different steeds. I guess I could have fast traveled over here. I've seen videos comparing the different steeds, so I do know that really, uh, what what's the horse? Wordier is faster technically, but Braviary is cooler, so I'll be using Braviary. <laughs> and also, when there's different like terrain and stuff. I think Braviary probably ends up being a little bit faster. Especially when you get a good ledge to go off of, like right here. Like this is, this is sick. Keeping my eyes peeled for the, the sparkles. What is up, Sam? How's it going? Ooh, a tree shaking. What's in the tree over here? Isn't that just Burmy? I don't want that. Oh. I'm not supposed to go into that. <laughs> Please teach me, Clyde, cowboy, child. Yo, what in the world did you do? Not much. Look at the size of that rift. How did, how did news get to him that I am supposedly at fault? If lightning starts pouring from it, all the Pokemon and Hisui could be thrown into a frenzy. The entire clan is in a panic now. I should have known that the only thing that could come from that rift was disaster. I need help. Please. Help? <laughs> oh, his face. <laughs> uh, well, that's not exactly something I can do. It's not that I wouldn't like to help you, but it would put Irida in a difficult position. Oh. Wrong hat. No, I'm not wearing the Pokemon hat, but that's in the other room. I don't feel like going to get it. <laughs> I truly do wish that I could repay you for quelling Cleaver's frenzy as you did. You must know that, but there's nothing I alone can do for you. Warden my Which one is that? Is that the old lady? She might be able to help you. She's a caring woman, after all. The most finally find my at the Worn Bridge. I believe it's significant to her. All right, let's find Mai. Is that the old lady? Seek out Mai? Okay, she's over here. 
God damn. Good thing they give you the bird, dude. So, like, go all the way over there and then, now go all the way over here. Wait, is that on this map? Yeah, it is. I'll just keep going along the edge instead of fast traveling. On the off chance of a shiny. And the music is kind of nice. I don't think I've heard this song before. Oh, through here. Well, maybe we can find... Oh, ooh, is there something up here? Because we never went up here. Oh, yeah. What is that? Oh, my... I'm a choke. And it's sleeping. What level is it? 44? <laughs> I never even thought about coming up here, man. They're all sleeping. Must be a choke nap time. I hope he doesn't get out of that ball. Okay. <gasps> hey, Penny! Let's fucking go. No, no. Yes. Stay in there. We've got a glob if it doesn't. Let's go, dude. Nice. That was like one of the few Pokemon in the... I think that might might be the only Pokemon in this area that I didn't have yet. Uh, Go get it. What's up, Duckverse? Trying to finish this story up. I would assume that we're close because uh, I've cleared out every air. Well, I haven't cleared out, but I've done every mission for every area. <laughs> and then they were like, yeah, that's everything. And then I woke up and it said disaster looming, like he hell is on earth. And I was like, okay. This is probably like close to the end. <laughs> I haven't been up on this area, though. I'd, like, actually not even considered that this would be an area. Is there anything in this water? Oh, there's an unknown there. I saw it. Uh. Um, it, it's, it's being weird. It won't go down anymore. Oh, really? A space-time distortion here, too? That's interesting timing. I was hoping when I first came out here that, it, like, the entire overworld would be a space-time distortion. But that is unfortunately not the case. Where the hell this unknown at? There it is. Yeah. Let's see if I can use a leaden ball. It's the least valuable ball I have. How did that get the hitbox? It was like five feet away. <laughs> what letter is that? I can't even tell what letter that's supposed to be. I'll take the bear. Oh! Alpha Blissey. Good lord. Anyways, there's treasure afoot. I will try for- I'm not gonna fight the Alpha Blissey, but I will just beam it in the back with a ball. Okay. Oops. I will at least try for- I'll take these two. Even if I can't get the big girl. Really? Because I've only caught one Chansey. Dude. Just stay in there. I'm gonna lose my mind on you. I don't want to fight you, but I'm burning through balls. Dude. <laughs> I didn't either. Yeah, this is my first time being up here. I caught a Blissey up there. Then that Chansey. I do want to catch this thing. Because I don't have one. And just... Shit. Just catching it is significantly easier for completing my Pokedex. Look at that. If I can get it with a Gigaton Ball in the back, we'll kind of be smoothing, I think. Also a bunch of medicinal herbs. 
It's only level 62. I could probably fight it. But it... Oh, let's go, dude. That is so good. I was like, I could probably fight it, but <laughs> it is a blissy. That would be annoying. I wonder if there's something new up here. Oh, no, he's waking up. No, it's just a boring Geodude. Okay. No, oh, thank you. I've already got Machoke maxed out in the Pokedex. I knew that Hippenny could spawn in the cave because I saw someone catch one down there. But it's probably rare. And up here there were just two walking around. Oh wait, wasn't there... There was a buried item up here. I do want to get that in case it's the lore. Might be an old poem or something. Oh yeah, that Chansey, or that Alpha Blissey was guarding it. It's definitely lore. Yes. The flow of time never stops. The past, future, and present. Space is ever-expanding dimensions. Our spirits, too, are as space. Nice. Poke Bible. Yeah, I've got... Aren't they in key items? I've got like a lot of them. I don't... I don't really care about them. <laughs> and I find them so infrequently that there's like nothing coherent about them. Ooh, there's Magikarp down there. Have I been in that water? No. Climb down. Oh wait, what am I even doing? Let's just fly there. I don't actually need to go down there. Have I been over here? I think this is where, yeah, this is where I got wrecked by like a bunch of butterflies early on or something. I've not been up on this rock though. Nothing? There's got to be an unknown up here or something. But, whatever. Another space-time distortion's forming? Oh, this is my with the Munchlax. It's so long since I've seen her. My, my, what a frightful sky. Such a disturbing sight would be enough to put anyone ill at ease. You don't know what brought this about, do you? I'm trying to find out. I heard from our leader what happened. Will-o'-the-wisps can spawn there? Yeah, I guess during the daytime they like fade in and out. Maybe I already got it. I could have like wiggled up there with my uh, word ear. <laughs> I did a lot of that. The only time, I know that the only time the wisps are always visible is at night. But you can't really tell what time it is right now. I heard from our leader what happened. You can't return that village yours, can you? But I'm afraid the Diamond Clan cannot be the ones to save you. The Diamond Clan could end up at war with the Galaxy team if things went badly. I think you'd regret that as much as anyone. Great Weirdeer took a liking to you. I want to offer you my support, but forgive me, I cannot help you. Don't abandon hope. Time solves all things. And besides, you seem to have a talent for making your own way in the world. I have no doubt you'll continue to find a path to walk. Okay. Oh. Cutscene. Like, actual cutscene. Oh. What is that? Jinx. Is it trying to tell me something? Or is this just to, like, show that I have a bond with Pokemon? What? Oh, this is Volo, isn't it? Strange events seem to follow you wherever you go, don't they? There's no dialogue in the Shinx cutscene? Yeah. 
I'm wondering if there was more significance to that, or if it was just like, you know, showcasing your bond with the Pokemon in the world. And if so, that might be like the first <laughs> subtle thing in the game. Because everything, every other cutscene is like everyone standing in a circle and saying the same thing over and over for 10 minutes. I like that. That was cute. I've been looking all over for you, you know? What would I do if I were to lose one of my favorite customers? I've, I don't think I've ever bought anything from this person. Uh, don't worry, I've already heard what happened. A good merchant knows well the importance of staying abreast of all the latest news. It seems you're in quite the pinch. No place for you among the Diamond Clan or the Pearl Clan. To say nothing of how poorly the Galaxy team has treated you. But not to worry, there are still corners of the Hisui region where we can stash you away in secret. I know a spot that would be the perfect hideaway. Leave it all up to me. Are you going to teleport me away? Uh, I was honestly going to go check out the time and space distortion, but... Here we are. I know, I know, it's no palace, but you know the saying about beggars and choosers. Right? <laughs> This fucking guy. Oh, this is its old, own whole, whole little area, huh? Kogita. Who the fuck is Kogita? Shirking your work to come pester me again? Even beneath a bleeding sky, you never change. Always a pleasure, Mr. Skorgita. But I'm afraid I'm not here to earn to learn more of Hisui's myths and legends. I kinda like her. She's kinda pretty. Now, Jamie is the woman of the hour. She's the one who quelled the frenzy of all the Pokemon nobles, believe it or not. Ah, uh, the poor wretch you spoke of. God damn. Lost in time and space. Dear me, lost one. It seems I'll be able to fulfill my duty at long last, thanks to you. Beauty? Indeed. I'm to guide you, Lost One, for the task of preventing great disaster falls to you. The rift in space I must be mended, lest time and space themselves be thrown out of balance. But come, you may enter my dear hideaway. There's much to be told. Oh my god. There's about to be a big exposition drop, isn't there? Cool house. The space-time rift is said to be a portal to innumerable other dimensions. In what such realm, one such realm, far and farther still from ours, dwells Almighty Sinnoh. I feel like she's gonna say both. The expanse from antiquity to eternity, and the expanse to all sides above and below. Time traces the path we tread from here and now into the future, while space yawns all-encompassingly, surrounding us in every direction. You see, don't you, the two together, time and space, comprise all creation, the universe. How can one claim that either is greater than the other, as those two clans do? I, I didn't mean to select, but I think I said you really can't. What's up, big waifu simp? Perhaps the truth is clear to a wanderer such as you, one who has known other ages. Now listen, Lost One, here's what you must do. Isui holds, holds three lakes of great importance. Lake Verity, Lake Valor, and Lake Acuity. Acuity? At each dwells a Pokemon said to embody one aspect of the mind. Are these legendary Pokemon? Uh, complete the trials each will set you. Or was that Shanks? One of them? Complete the trials each will set to you set you, and bear their gifts to the shrouded ruins. There you may receive the red chain. With it, perhaps you can bind the world together. Bind the world, you say? You mean it won't close the rift? Kindly spare me your doubts, young man. I know the old words and what they bid us do. How true they are is not mine to know. Genshin dailies before you swap back to Elden Ring. Nice, are you enjoying it? It looks fun. I will, I, not Genshin Daily, it's about Elden Ring. <laughs> and regardless of their truth, 
I am bound to pass them on. How callous of my ancestors to leave their legends to their children without a thought for the hardship it would cause them. But here we are. You know your duty, and you'll do it, won't you? Of course. There is nobility in knowing what must be done and seeing to it. Oh god, Arceus is hitting me up! Mistress Kogita's got a lovely workbench here. If you need materials, I'll be glad to help. Let's go. Yeah, what about the pastures, though? I'm gonna keep my team, but just just curious. That is a problem, isn't it? Abba? What? Pokemon out there? Off we go, Jamie. Wait, you're gonna... I thought you were gonna give me stuff. I mean, a lot of changes to how magic works. Sick. About oh, it's an Abra. Oh, cool. So he would teleport. Oh, the Pokemon are all gonna help me. He would teleport my Pokemon from the pasture if I want. I mean, how was I doing it at the camps? <laughs> I don't feel like you really need a in-universe exploration. And if you're going to do an Abra now, maybe an Abra at the camps would have been cool, but whatever. It's from Silene, I bet. To so Jamie, you may use my Pokemon as a go-between to access the pastures. I've also ensured that you'll be able to utilize our base camps without issue. I have every confidence in your ability as an adept survey court member to bring this bizarre situation under control promptly. Thank you, Silene. Good tidings, then? It's a secret. Now then, so we're to visit three lakes. Yeah, Silene is cool. Doesn't sound like an easy task, that's for sure. It sure would be wonderful to have a kind soul who might help us out. Irida! Quite the opportunist, aren't you, Volo? Such a cons consummate guild merchant. I've managed to reassure my people for now. The wardens are keeping a close eye on their nobles, too. Seems all, all's quiet for the moment. And so, here we are. <laughs> Fem Cyrus to the rescue. <laughs> but still, we'll never get away with openly aiding you. Oh my god, I would like to like have control of my character again at some point. It's like the beginning of the game. <laughs> but this is infinitely... This is like the... Interesting. Like, most of the time when there's cutscenes in this game, I'm, I'm kind of like, I, I want it to be done. I'm actually kind of interested in this. If we were to undermine the commander's direct orders, relations would go strained. Long story short, we want to help, but without drawing attention, so it'll just be one of us. Me or her, it's up to you. But the answer should be obvious. Yeah, Irida. Obviously, Irida. That's cool, the Abra. I thought you would give me frickin' materials, bro. Irida, of course, yeah. It's like choosing another starter. <laughs> I was the one who got you what you needed when you first set out to quell Cleaver. You and I made his bombs together. Bigger things are at stake here? I guess. It's just like, what if they made the rest of the story missions interesting, you know? <laughs> Pokemon story's always about giving reasons to fight your rival. It's not really a rival, though. Not in this game. Yeah, I choose you. <laughs> it said I choose you, like in Pokemon. Uh, just what I'd expect of you, Jamie. You made the right choice. You won't regret it. Those girls gotta stick together. So then the leftover leader will... <laughs> leftover. Thank you. Thank you again. Jamie trusts me enough to leave the tough job up to me alone. I'll be keeping an eye on the commander so I can let you all know if anything happens. Okay, so in this game, Arceus, like, plucks you out of your life and plops you down here, like, 100, 200 years in the past, and just says, hey, catch all the Pokemon. <laughs> and that's, like, pretty much it. Um, and then, like, some Pokemon start acting weird, and that that's pretty much it. And now there's a big hole in this guy. Of course, of course. And the lucky chosen one comes with us to the lakes. We can fill you in on the details as we go. 
Hey, weren't you gonna let me use a crafting bench though? I'm kind of low on balls. The first task will be to decide which of the Hisui's blah 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 lakes to visit, but we should get moving. Uh, if the commander were to get wind, it would only make things worse. I mean, you at whichever lake we choose. Oh yeah, and like since I'm I fell out of the hole in the sky, everyone's like, hey, you're probably the reason the hole is getting bigger. <laughs> Even the the drag of cutscene sword and shield had. Hmm. I don't see. I don't even remember the cutscenes. It's <laughs> sword and shield, to be honest. Um. I liked Hop in Sword and Shield. I liked that he like we we owned him like constantly, and it made him sad. I thought that was kind of cool. That's about all I really remember from Sword and Shield, as far as like not in game story stuff. But I guess that's like pretty much all that happens in Sword and Shield. That's like a pretty bare bones. <laughs> story. You two do what needs doing. Okay, let's, uh... Yeah, people hate it on Hop, but, like... I don't know, I thought he was like the best part of the game. And also I feel like hating on Hop is kind of half the point of Hop. <laughs> You're supposed to be like, damn, this dude's a fucking loser. Because he is. Oh wow, hold up. Why do I have so many materials? Did did a uh, Volo give them to me? And I just like didn't notice? Well, I've got a lot of gigaton balls, don't I? Oh wait, I can't even make gigaton balls. Oh wait, I can. I've got 19 of them. Ah, do I want wing balls? We're gonna get jet balls soon. So it feels... It hurts to make wing balls, but I will make just 20. We'll top it off at an even 40 on ultra balls. Do I need potions or revives? No. Got nine. I mean, that's plenty. Thirteen super potions. Oh, we can make max potions. I'll make ten. Alright. Oh, I can make some sticky balls, too. No, that's not what I meant to do. I can make a singular sticky ball. <laughs> All right, how many smoke bombs do I have? Eight. I'll make a couple more. I want to get the hell out of here. Uh, seven. You got Genshin? Genshin? Di Has Genshin even been out five hundred days, dude? That's crazy. I the the dedication is appreciated. I did my Hearthstone. There was like a period of a few years for sure, uh, back in high school when I definitely did all my Hearthstone dailies. It came out late 2022. Fair enough. I wanted to play Genshin when it first came out, but... or late 2020. But I, I never did. Where would we be heading? Oh! To the Gumi outbreak. <laughs> oh man, I wish they didn't patch They patched out the guaranteed shiny outbreak, man That sucks What I know about Genshin is it's like uh, Breath of the Wild-esque Yeah, I So I got my shiny Weasel Or Floatzel from an outbreak And I actually I actually got my shiny Gyarados from an outbreak too. I sh I reset the shiny Floatzel for like forty minutes probably, but the the shiny Gyarados was actually just there the first time. I was like, I don't feel like resetting on Gyarados because it's gonna be a grind. And then my Zubat I just found, and same with my Toxicroak, I just found them. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna go that outbreak. It's a shame we can't 
get our resets going, but that is what it is. Yeah, of course. Outbreaks are always more important than story missions. What the hell is that? That's a... Clefairy. The prospect of shinies is much more appealing than an outbreak. Always and forever. Where the hell are we? Oh, this is the Coronet Highlands. Okay. I wasn't even paying attention to which area we were in. Yeah, I mean... Oh, wow, that was scary. I'm really... I'm okay with finding a shiny Zubat. It is a green shiny, which are infamous, but... Crobat is sick, and uh, shiny Crobat is pink. Yeah, the only shiny I actively hunted after was uh, the Floatzel. And Genshin, yeah, I'd love to check it out one day, maybe eventually, but I just, I don't... Every time I've tried to play a gacha, it's boring. Granted, like, Genshin is a, a gacha with actual gameplay. <laughs> Which all the other gachas I've, I've tried, like haven't been oh there's an alpha around here um oh god toxicroak ew it's annoying around here actually we'll just get the gumi the shiny toxicroak was actually the first toxicroak that i caught <laughs> which is kind of crazy what the hell is that hopping around down there Skun tank I've never played Breath of the Wild. I need to play it, though. And I will, one day. Probably on stream. What the hell is that? Oh, that's just Iron Chunk. Oh, cool, you got a shiny Stantler? Yeah, all my shinies are the things that I have on my team. Like, I've got four shinies, which is a lot. But it's not, it's, you know, few enough that I want to keep every single one that I find on my team. Alright, let's get in here. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. You suck. Alright, y'all need to... Wing balls it is then. Oh shit, that was a bad throw. We're not being aggressive. I've had Goomies in the past be really aggressive, so this is nice. Change of pace. I wish they would stop zooming around though. Oh shit. I played a bit of the first destiny and I really why why are my none of my balls working? I played a bit of the first destiny. Wh that was <laughs> We're bad. I enjoyed destiny. Oh. These, none of these Gumi are being aggressive. Maybe I just have bad luck with the the other Gumi I encountered that wanted to kill me. Even when I was locking on, it wasn't working. <laughs> Throw in their trail. Which happens sometimes. Like, you gotta lead a bit sometimes. Which is fine. See, like, I was locked on there. And there. I feel like I have better luck not locking on, usually, to be completely honest. Looks like no shiny from this outbreak. Which is unfortunate. Oh, thank you for coming closer so I can use... I'll just use a leaden ball. Mostly because I don't want it in my inventory anymore. Let's organize our... There we go. Much better. 
Stop zooming. Wild child. And we actually need some more of you. This is the last one from the outbreak. This is my... Are you kidding me? Well, it's gone. Okay. This is my fourth outbreak. My first outbreak was a Pichu. And then we had... The Floatzel. And then last stream we had a Scyther. And the Scyther outbreak was when I found out that... <laughs> they fixed the reset method, which was unfortunate. Okay, uh... Yeah, Ancient Retreat. Your first outbreak was Cherubi. You're very lucky. Yeah. I've actually been pretty fortunate with Cherubi. I've caught, like, three of them... Another outbreak? Pseudo Wudo? I mean, oh my god, dude. No, yeah, and when the Daybreak update came out, uh, enjoy your Elden Ring, Mr. Meme. Uh, when Cherubi can be found in trees. Yeah, they changed it, so if you, like, save and then reset your game, uh, the outbreaks will disappear. They did that with the, the Daybreak update. Which, like, I get it, because, like, Shinies felt really devalued because of that. But also, it is really fun to catch shinies, and maybe you should let people have the fun. But, I don't know. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not gonna, like, cry over it, you know? And shinies are still... more common in mass outbreaks. Okay... Yeah, just die. Oh my god, a second one's coming over. Do I have a Murkrow? Yeah, I don't. I don't mind. Like if you if you got the game early, you got your shiny hunting in. Maybe, you know. Oh, it it ran away. Oh, that's an alpha. Is it mad at me? Is it aggroed on me? Excuse me. I wasn't even close to you. What the hell? Why are they all so aggressive on me? I think this is a good jet ball use. You're being annoying. I do need to catch some of these guys. I don't I didn't have like any of them. I'll just didn't ignore the alpha. I just wanted to leave. Like leave me alone. Murkrow snitch on their friends. It noticed- oh my god, dude. We'll just fight it. We'll fight it. Just stop being annoying. Level you 50 I didn't want to go in with Flozo. I wanted to go in with Raichu. Ugh. Oh, devs reacting to speedruns is super fun. You didn't know they patched it out? Oh, really? Time-space distortions do that? I didn't know that. But yeah, I've seen... Oh god, what dev was it? You just brave bird me? Zam. Let's put in Raichu. Was it Slay the Spire? I think, yeah, I saw Slay the Spire devs uh, watching people speedrun their game. That was really funny. <laughs> Yeah, I like when the, the devs see that shit, they're like, you can do that? <laughs> I don't think I have any Honchkrow, actually. So getting a shiny here would be good. Or good, just catching one. Alpha, especially. Very explicitly not a shiny. Alright. Let's drop a super on our boy. Uh, Drop a hyper on our boy. And my freaking stealth spray wore off during that battle. All the pseudo wudo are just big chilling. <laughs> They're being chilling. 
Yeah, got the head honcho, honch crow. I love pseudo widow, dude. They look so goofy. <laughs> oh, he went to sleep. Oh, I missed. Don't you go anywhere, boy. All right, I'll get you. Oh. Boy. What? Stay in the balls. <laughs> My man's getting his cardio in. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, are Pseudo Wudo not even aggressive? Okay. They're not aggressive or fleers. They're just, you know, they just say, oh, well that one fled. Okay, maybe I should stay in the grass. Oh, look at that one. <laughs> He's fucking booking it. Pseudo's react. Yeah, yeah, they, they just pretend to be trees. It's super funny. Mr. Mimes are also really good. Hey. You little shit. Yeah, I can tell that they're a bit hard to catch. I hear his footsteps. There he is. What was that orange with the ultra ball? You son of a gun. You little trasher. I was about to start saying rude things. But... Okay, they're all gone. It's whatever. Uh, did we really go to a Valor Cavern? Oh, I guess that's what all these caves I've been seeing that you go into and they're just empty. I guess that's what they're all about. Yes, always so many video games. Uh, next game I'm going to be buying is definitely Kirby. I'm looking forward to that. I've never, like, completed a Kirby game, actually. You kept farming. Do I have Bonsai? I don't know if I have Bonsai. You can check. I don't have Munchlax. I know that. I do have Hippinny. Oh yeah, I got a Piplup. <laughs> I need to evolve that thing. Do I have Togepi? I think I do have Togepi. You played Kirby on the SNES? Well, I played the Kirby Golf game on uh, Nintendo Online. On NSO. I like that game. And I played Planet Robotabot. Uh, but I never finished it. I just feel... I do have Bonsai. I have a single Bonsai. <laughs> I have a Rots and a Hippinny. Oh, and I got both. I got a Crany Dose and uh, a Shield on in a single Distortion. I do have a Togepi. Yeah, so I guess the only other baby I need is a... Um... Frickin... Oh, I need a Cleffa. Oh, and I need a baby for the Electivire and Magmortar lines. Yeah, I saw people talking about how hard they were to find online, and then I, I got it easy. <laughs> yeah, I need Munchlax. I need the other starters. There was something else. Oh, yeah. I caught, like, hella Magna... Magnetons and Magna Zones, but I've yet to see a single Magna Might. So I see that potentially being really annoying. Let's see if anything wacky spawns in the ruins. I only have one Ralts, I think. So I'll catch a couple. I'm getting really sidetracked, but that happens to me every time I play this game, dude. It's impossible for me to focus on this game. It's so fun, just doing shit. I did catch the Alpha Galate Galade in the, uh... In the ice world ruins. And the Curlia. So I need a Gardevoir. And of course, more Ralts always help. You've only seen Magnemite in a space-time distortion? 
Magby and Electkid were easy to find. Are they in distortions or are they just like overworld spawns? Because I sure as hell haven't seen them. Now, is there going to be a legendary Pokemon in here or what? They're overworld spawns? Okay, well, that is that's pretty easy. You just go to their place and... I figured, where's Magmar and Electabuzz? There were definitely none on the Fire Island when I went there. It's said to have been formed by volcanic eruption, much like Lake Verity. Though there are also other theories that say it was carved out of the midst of a Pokemon battle. You found a lot of Magby. Magby. Or Magby? Magby? That's interesting. Azelf. When Azelf took flight, the will to do what needs doing was born in people's hearts. Yeah, big waifu simp, but you do get that very late in the game. <laughs> the bird, the big bird is the last steed. Because it kind of, it kind of makes the other steeds kind of pointless. <laughs> Your arc phone is beeping. Oh. Okay. Yeah, the ride Pokemon are fun. It's I was really hyped when I got my Braviary finally. It's gonna make finding shinies so much easier. It seems like that's how everyone finds shinies. Uh outside of the reset method, which doesn't work anymore, is they just fly around on Braviary. <laughs> Let's head in, Jamie. I want my chair so it doesn't lean back. Yes, Arceus is God. <laughs> I'm struggling to get comfortable with my legs right now. <sighs> what an eerie space. Why would there be columns inside a cave anyway? God, well, God... Oh, it's an alpha quillfish. Or the quillfish evolution. God found our... He When he transported us back in time... He took our phone and made it into an ARC phone. <laughs> Those quills look vicious. I mean, we'll fuck them up. What type is it, actually? It's poison. Well, shit. If I knew it would auto-put me into a battle. God damn it. <laughs> what is it, water poison? Overquill, it is the new one. It's Dark Poison? Ow. We're at, we're at like the perfect level for this, dude. That's so exciting. Hopefully a strong style will one shot though. <laughs> yeah, God upgraded us to an iPhone 12. Aw oh, damn, it didn't one shot. RIP Raichu. Eat shit, little boy. He almost killed himself with the recoil. Huh. Who do we want to send in? Let's just send Crobat in. The battles are so much faster, Big Waifu Simp. Like, the, the... The battling is still the same. Yeah, it's so it's so nice to have a, a perfectly on-curve team, right? The battle system is largely the same, aside from Agile and Strong Style. And, well, I guess that there is an action order. But the best thing about the battles is that... They're so much faster. There's no, like, long, you know, intro screen or anything anymore. You just do your move and it happens quick, right? Like in normal Pokemon, battles can take a long ass time. In this game, that is not the case. They are quick. I knew you could do it, Jamie. This game, it just has so much godly quality of life shit going on in this game. Oh. That's a legendary Pokemon. Cune.
Show to me unyielding will. Strike me if you can. Hold up. Oh. We gotta fight it? Oh, like a noble? Oh no, he just wants us to hit him once. Oh, you little shit. Where'd he go? This is cool. How am I supposed to get him? I got... What? I didn't hit him, <laughs> and it went into a cutscene. You seem to hear a voice inside your head. Will you abandon this folly? No. Oh, man, it overshot him. Oh, I think I was too close to the exit. Oh, you little rat. You need a bigger hitbox. That wasn't fair. Am I getting too close to exit? Is that, th that what's happening? Seems you had best give up. Oh, he, he's trying to talk shit. Okay. I'm not through with yet. Or am I getting too close to the exit? I don't know, actually. Hold up. Which, which way is the exit? Let's get over on this side. <laughs> so we know that's not the case. <laughs> that went right through you. You cheated, bro. Oh, that would have that would have smacked you. No, okay, so we weren't getting too close to the exit. He's just trying to talk shit and get us to quit. I'm not through yet. Do you accept that? He looked like he he accepted that a bit. Yeah, this dude's hacking. We we threw one and that was good enough. Hune, you impressed? You like what you saw, bud? Take this piece of the spirit to bind the world once more. Thank you, dude. <laughs> I mean, I thought I was messing up. Shit. <laughs> A Zelf's Fang. Proof that you've completed the trial set by Azelf. Azelf? I don't know. The being of willpower that lives in Lake Valor. Thank you. That looked exhausting. It wasn't exhausting as much as it was just, like, mildly confusing. <laughs> yeah, I got the poke parts. Shit. That's like half the game with them damn wisps. Oh my god, dude. That's gonna be hell. To complete my Pokedex, getting all them wisps. Looked like that worked out well. I must say, you know an awful lot about Hisui, Volo. I suppose a merchant like you sees all sorts of things in their travels. That's right. That's right. You could say it's because I'm a merchant, but mostly I'm just naturally filled with curiosity. I'm just now noticing that I actually had my stuff out because I was recording earlier. I'm, I'm dead tired, you guys. I've been up since like 2 a.m. And it is 12.08 p.m. now. I want to know exactly what happened in the past that led us this particular present. Or more accurately, I suppose, I want to know where I came from and where I'm headed. I want to know my path. Same for me. Our clan settled at the very spot where our four forebears once beheld Almighty Sinnoh. But I have still yet to see Almighty Sinnoh myself. Waiting matters to ponder, but we have an important task. Do you want to return to Miss Kogita's home? Let's go. That's about when you woke up too? Yeah, I mean, I did fall asleep at 8pm though. And that's kind of what I usually do on uh, Tuesday nights and Saturdays. Braviary made the whiffs much easier. For sure. I've heard it sucks for like the last one or two though, because there's like underground and like shit, you know, <laughs> stuff that makes it more annoying. Uh, a Zelf's Fang, so the legends told it true. And the red chain must be real as well. I got all the wisps in Jubilife at least. <laughs> Sorry, JFM, the VOD's not going nowhere. <laughs> Get off your phone! Get off your phone! <laughs> or don't. I'm, uh, do whatever you want. I don't care. I'm an adult, but y you can make your own decisions. I beg your car pardon, Kogita, ma'am? But what do these Pokemon that represent 
the mind have to do with this red chain, and why exactly should it bind this world? Your doubt suggests a keen intellect, but I see you're not your clan's leader for nothing. Without the mind, were the rift to widen and the very world to end, would we even know it? One might even say the world, time, space, and all creation exists only because our minds are there to perceive it. You'll just a screen share to all 200 people? Oh my god. That sounds scary. <laughs> that would make it probably the largest stream I've ever had. I think I've capped out at like 150? No. Over 100 over on my other channel. Perhaps the Red Chain's purpose is to let one see creation as it truly is. Them post-amphibia streams would, would get up there sometimes. I... what? So does the mind create the world? But isn't it the other way around? Or is it... Uh, they're getting philosophical over here. Such are myths, my child. Teaching us about the world in their own incomprehensible ways. They urge us to think more for ourselves on the nature of Almighty Sinnoh and on the nature of the world which we dwell. Econ 2400? 20, <laughs> Bro, I'm a college dropout. Don't, don't listen to shit I say. Uh, you're absolutely right. Myths and legends are such fascinating things to study. In any case, all we have to do is complete two more trials. Yeah. I had this phase uh, <laughs> when I experimented with uh, substances a few years back. <laughs> uh, how nonchalant you sound. How confident of successes to which you contributed? Nothing. You tag along only for the chance to gawk at more ancient ruins. Damn. Okay. What am I investigating? It's an antique tea set. Alright. Dump this shit. Damn, did I say I had 800 black tumble stones? I guess it was 500. Guess I'll make a couple more freaking wing balls, bro. Damn, we went through the ultra balls. Oh my god, we're almost out of... Dude, them iron chunks go quick. <laughs> yeah, she's a, kind of a, a mean... Uh... She bad, though. She bad, though. She's allowed to say it. She allowed to be that way. <laughs> I'm with it. Now, if there were another outbreak... Ah, oh, that would have been so hype. Mm, we'll go to the Meyerlands. <laughs> with her MFT. <laughs> Say, here's the motherfucking tea. You're stupid. <laughs> Come on, just give me a shiny. Give me a shiny anything. Is there anything going on in these ruins now that, uh... Now that we're further? Or is it still just nothing? Is there a wisp hidden in here or something? Nothing? Okay. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. <laughs> it's so funny trying to fly around in spaces like that when you're clearly not supposed to. Speaking of that freaking iron chunks, gimme. I didn't mean to jump down. Have I done all the unknown quests yet? No. Does something trigger in there if we do? Uh, we have... That many unknown. Four, eight. We have nine unknown. Oh, it literally just says. I didn't have to count. <laughs> I haven't been looking up guides for them or anything. I just, like, get them when I see them. That's another Bonsai down there. I want that. Yeah, 
Yeah, unknowns. They're like... The unknown are cool because they're just like hiding. Like in plain sight usually. They're just like chilling. It's pretty dope. Oh, that's an alpha combi. We want to catch that in case it's a female. We actually need more combi because I don't know if any of the ones we have are female. I have not been paying attention. Um, um, do we have any honeycomb? You shit. Eh. Is this a female? It's a male? Ugh. Then perish. Yeah. I know, I know, I, someone told me about the red mark, but I don't know where exactly you're supposed to look for the red mark. So I always just go into battle with them. <laughs> There's gotta be something up here. No? Well, we can, uh... We can get a good, good glide from up there. It's on the middle head. I'll try to keep an eye out for that. No promises, though. We're actually gonna go around here. I don't know if we've been over here. Have we been over here? Well, there's another combi. Are you a female? You're a male. Are you a female? They're all male, dude. Damn Graveler. What the Graveler doing? I, is this Acorn? Apricorn? Oh, Onyx. Ouch. Actually, I think we do need to catch a couple more Onyx. I'm not gonna worry about him. We'll just like... Let one Wing Ball go at him. If that gets him, it gets him. I'm not too worried about him. We've got... A couple, I, I guess we have six Onyx, it says right there. And I think we have a couple Steelix, too. And we have an Alpha Onyx. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Go in, stop climbing. <laughs> what? Was I not supposed to go in? I already did that cave? Oh. Disregard. <laughs> Wait, how the hell do I get back? Shit, how the fuck do I get out of here? Okay. <laughs> I guess I just clicked the wrong place. Whoops. I was running around there. Why the fuck was I there, dude? I was running around for no goddamn reason. <gasps> Why are there so many outbreaks, dude? Okay, oh my god, we're gonna... I'm, I'm too fucking... I can't resist, I can't resist. I want a shiny... I already have a shiny Gyarados, but if I could get a shiny Magikarp. I'm, I'm sorry, this will be quick. It's They're just Magikarp, it'll be quick. God damn it. <laughs> I cannot resist. Outbreak, outbreak. Where did I put the flag? It, it's too... It's just too much fun just running around, dude. Can you count that as a complaint with the game? It's too fun. You just get sucked into it and just start... Keep running around doing shit. <laughs> oh, 
onyx. That was a big onyx, but it wasn't an alpha. Oh, this is Graveler Canyon. <laughs> what the hell are that? What is that? Oh, it's rock salt. You with Elden Ring? I mean, Elden Ring probably has a more full world than this game, to be fair. Ah, shit. Oh, yo, we actually potentially got him. Ah. Uh, if it's a good open world game, they're like that. <laughs> is it, this is where the Clefairy are, right? Is it not nighttime, though? Or no, that's over here, actually. Are the Clefairy here? Because I need a Clefa. What the fuck is that? Oh no, it must be daytime. It's hard to tell. Yeah, like whenever anything happens in this game, it's like, oh, I'm supposed to go that way, so I'll go this way. Why is that green? Why does the water look like that? What the hell? That was weird. Those guys aren't even part of the outbreak. <laughs> yeah, why does the water look like that? <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, chill. Maybe I should be using Gigathon balls. Like, kind of a waste of them, but... Actually, I'll, I'll use wing balls, because they require less... What? Oh, okay, that one was my fault. Dude. Dude. Okay. Oh, yeah, Basque Allegiance. Sick. Okay. It, it's so annoying to catch Pokemon in the water. I like Cleavor. I don't have any Cleavor, but I think Cleavor is cool. All that and not even a shiny? Not even a shiny? God damn it. Okay. Okay. Get me the hell out of here. It is cool that Basculin got some got some love. It's kind of just like a a bitch. Like, don't you... Don't you have to make it do... Mm. Now, why is there a Pokeball over there? I don't see that on my map. Oh, is that... Oh, that's how you leave. Okay. You have to make, like, the male ones do... Agile... Strong style, and the female ones use Agile style or something? Oh, you, you, they need to take Recoil, right? You have to take so much damage from recoil moves. We, we need more balls, dude. I can't I can't keep doing this. <laughs> oh, we got some some pebbles out there. That's pretty good. We got a couple iron chunks. <laughs> oh wow, we can make a whopping two freaking balls. I th I actually need to buy some ultra balls, which sucks because it cost so much he doesn't even sell ultra balls Ugh. you never have enough balls dude we'll buy 35 and pay out the ass for them oh it's an amalgamation of dead basculins that's cool oh my this is this is hell <laughs> this is hell. Dude, there, why are there so many mass outbreaks? I've never had this many mass outbreaks, dude. I had four in 30 hours, and now... Now there's one every 10 minutes! Why is this happening? Like, I can't say no. I... I need to work on my self-control, bro. After this one, I'm going to the next place. But if I could get the shiny bronze on, you know, like, 
The world is literally breaking. That's a good point. Well, then maybe this is the best time to be, you know, uh, grinding them out. <laughs> yeah, then maybe maybe I'm doing the right thing by hitting all these mass outbreaks, you know? Now let, let me actually check my research level. Unless it's a Pokemon, I like getting the next one. We're only research level 8. Which sucks because we don't have level 10. Which means less likely to be shiny, but... Whatever. Yeah, we'll definitely go to the... We'll continue story after this outbreak, unless I don't want to. <laughs> I do want to finish main story this... This frickin' stream, though. Yeah. Uh... Surprise outbreak <laughs> farming stream. Whoa! We already caught you. We already caught that guy. He's scripted. I wish I could get an outbreak of the new Electrode. That's probably my, my favorite one, is a new Voltorb. I like the way new Voltorb looks. I think he's a cool little guy. Bronzor. I don't even know if shiny uh, Bronzor line is any good. I don't know what they look like. Can I get them with great balls? Uh, they're kind of hard with great balls. Oh god, I just got all their attention. They're not any easier with Ultra Balls, so I'll just use Great Balls. Shiny, please. Good back shot. Where are they spawning now? Where are they spawning? I don't... Oh, shit. Oh, there they're spawning. There was a delay. Was it yellow? Whatever. Gray... Uh, yeah, orange, yellow... Oh, you didn't see that. <laughs> Close enough to the same. It's not looking like we're going to get a shiny, though. I think this was the last wave. That dude was asleep. Oh, that was a good snipe, bro. Is it orangey? Get him. You suck. You suck, you suck. You're the last one, so... I'll just assault you. I have a ton of balls of mud. I sh should have been more careful. That's a catch. Okay. Uh, I feel like I'm... What the hell is that over there? Oh, it's a shaking tree. I thought that was a huge hulking Pokemon. <laughs> let there be another master. <laughs> let let the I'm kind of digging the mass outbreaks. Let there be another one. Let's see what we got now. No. Oh, fine. I guess we'll do story. <laughs> Alright. Alola! You're in the wrong game, bro. Ah, just the person I've been waiting for. Bro, I'm an enemy. Everyone hates me. This must be a side mission that I haven't uh, activated. My Kyo Kyo wandered off to go play, but he didn't come back yet. What is it? Kyo Kyo? You mean Vulpix? Vulpix were called Kyo Kyo? Were they? I don't remember that. Oh. All the others are fire type, bro. That's what Alolan Vulpix looks like. This dude's missing five Alolan Vulpix? Oh my god. 
I mean, I won't be doing that right now. I'm going to be actually doing main main story. Oh, there's still two locations I haven't explored. I need to remember that. Can you go up there? I want to fly off the top of this thing. We'll get really good air. I'll probably be able to go across the whole area. Oh, and there's a wisp up here. <laughs> right? Hella voltics. Yeah, but someone was telling me Alolan Vulpix is in the game, so I'm not too surprised at that quest. You know, aside from the fact that I had pulled it off the board, so I was mildly aware of it. Alright, we're gonna get some good flying here. Alright, off we go. Am I too high, actually, for Pokemon to spawn? Maybe I should be a bit lower. So I want to be able to see the shinies if shinies spawn. Yeah, eh. Ouch. I'll just climb over here. Or fly over here and then climb. It's probably faster. Maybe. It's more exciting. There's a shiny rock, yeah. That's a boring... I want a real shiny. <gasps> Alpha Kaimeko. Oh, there's Chingling over there, too. Get this dude with a quick... Whoa! Oh, no, the berry disappeared. Go get it. Oh, no, that's looking right at us. This is the world's stupidest Kaimeko. He eats so quick! That wasn't even a back shot. What's up, Digis? Oh yeah, I came out to this little island earlier and I was confused about it. Yeah, did we not even get that thing? Oh, I do need some of those. What is that? Oh, this Basque one. Okay, little rat. All right, well, if we can get one. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Dude, wasn't that take like 40 minutes to get this second cave? Could be a fluke of geography, or perhaps it's connected to a Pokemon somehow. Pretty attacked by Uxie. Uxie? Problem solved. There's going to be a puzzle in here. Let's go puzzles, Pog. Your arc phone is beeping. The flash go crazy. Oh my god. I have a bunch of unread comments. Ugh. Imagine doing story right. <laughs> Smart security phone app. <laughs> a tool that, Don't say here we go, that makes me scared. A tool that can make caves simply appear from nowhere is quite a handy one to have. I wonder what waits inside. I imagine there may be Pokemon in there. Let me do something real quick. I really need to, like, breathe deep through my nose, but I don't want to be gross. So I'm going to mute my mic. My microphone doesn't have a mute button, so I have to do it in OBS.
Ah, uh, goddamn allergies. I'm all out of day, Quill. A chill in the air. What is this? Oh. Are they dark ice type in this game? The dreaded baneful fox? Hmm. Normal ghost. Thank you. Oh god. Yeah. They were white, so I was thinking maybe ice, but no. Well, I guess probably Raichu. Can you backstrike a overworld Pokemon? No, you cannot. <laughs> the ball goes through them. I'll start with Raichu and get a Thunder Wave in, and then switch to Typhlosion for a Hex. That's my plan. Normal Ghost is good typing, for sure. His stats are raised. Uh oh. I mean, we'll just hit a strong style. Thunder Wave. Raichu will die. And then uh, Typhlosion can hex the hell out of him. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Shadow Claw, huh? Oh fuck, you're right. Oh god, it's normal. Part normal, we can't hex him. Oh my god. I'm so dumb. <laughs> you guys, oh no! Damn it. Damn. Alright, get that offensive stat lowered, I guess. Oh, we get to go twice because he went strong style like an idiot. Haha. <laughs> okay, you died anyway, Zorart. You're trash. <laughs> you outplayed me and I still beat you. <laughs> okay. The Baneful Fox. It is a Pokemon said to be filled with malice. We are told stories about it as children. It's the animal from every Magical Girl anime. Come, I will test your knowledge. Combi, Zubat, Unknown, Magneton, Dusclops. Okay. Taking a picture. How many are their eyes? All of them? Okay. Combi, that would be... I'm not gonna look at chat. 246... Zero eyes on Zubat. Unknown has one, so seven. Magneton has three, so ten. It's eleven. Oh. One by one, yet all at once. What? One by one, but all at once. What the fuck does that mean? Oh no. Oh. Okay, I get it. So Combi has six. Right? <laughs> I, I think. Zubat has zero. <laughs> what if it's actually the game like getting you to put your own zip code in? It's doxing you. Unknown has one, I think. Magneton has three, and Dusclops has one. Uh, 
That sounds like correct. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> hey, what's up, Joey? Joey, you missed it. Uh, we we hit like fucking like ten uh like mass outbreaks. We were running through them shit and not a single shiny. <laughs> Answers the three funny numbers on the back. We're pogging at the claw. Oh man. Someone needs to get a screenshot of that. That would be a pretty good like like meme format with them the character with their hands outstretched like Hold and you can put whatever you want in their hands. That's a really good meme format. Damn, I should've it's not too late. How do we save? Yeah, they made it so you can't reset no more, which is a shame. What did we hit? We hit Pseudo Wudo Bronzor. You guarantee it's on Reddit? Probably. Let me just see if we got it in the screenshot. I think we did. 30 seconds? Yeah, we definitely got it. Oh, you can't take a screenshot of a video? That's dumb. I don't care. So what if 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 we have Bayonetta's ass? <laughs> oh, it's not even on screen anymore. You have to go down. We got... Yeah, we also have Fox Crotch. Or Wolf Crotch. <laughs> we don't limit ourselves to Bayonetta ass. We're, we're progressive here. Diversity. I assume all went well, Jamie. Still, I must wonder. <laughs> you... <laughs> you obtained bitches. You can pause it and save a screenshot. I guess you could just edit it. I don't know. In the video? <laughs> I'll pause the video on my Switch and handheld and then take a picture of my phone. That'd be pretty good. <laughs> Still, I must wonder. Why don't they give us a, the red chain? Why all this running about? To prove you earn it. Yeah, you gotta be worthy. Perhaps you're right. Who, who knows what would happen if it fell into the wrong hands, after all. Though, on the other hand... What use would those wrong hands have for it? Who can say for sure? Maybe the red chain has some other use besides mending the world. The red chain's as mysterious as this entire predicament we're in. But if we continue visiting the lakes, we'll get close to an answer. Yeah, it would make it also, like, way more obviously fake if it's this, like, shitty, like, pixelated, you can, like, See the lines in the screen <laughs> from, you know, taking a picture of a screen with your phone. And then it's like a perfect crisp, like, 1080 image plastered onto it. Oh, cutscene! I sense a warmth to it. I do have to... Oh, it's Irida now. I do have to wonder if anyone else has ever completed the trials of these like Pokemon. Indeed. Yeah, we may want to add just a dash more speed. Kokomo is on YouTube. By the way, <laughs> a few streams ago, I saw he I saw that dude Kokomo, I saw him get on Animal Crossing. <laughs> so I texted him. I said, dude, when did you get Animal Crossing? I didn't know you got that. He said, I don't have Animal Crossing. I was like, what are you talking about? It said you got on Animal Crossing. I saw it on stream. Like I sent him a screenshot. He was like, what the fuck? <laughs> he goes and he gets on his Switch account. He was like, these motherfuckers hacked me. They bought Animal Crossing. They bought Sky Skyward Sword. They bought like two or three other games. And they bought it. But the thing is, they bought it on his account with his credit card. So he changed all his shit. And then he found out his Discord got hacked. They bought Nitro on his account. They were buying all this shit, and they so they he kept changing his, his Discord. Yeah, he kept changing his Discord. Let me let me find this. It it gets crazier. They kept changing, logging into his Discord, even when he would change it. I I gotta find this. <laughs> 
free games pog <laughs> no his wallet bro um they kept getting on his discord and i was like fuck i sent him like passwords to streaming services so i went and uh went back and like deleted all like the sensitive stuff i, I sent him we were all shit talking we were like fuck you daryl eat shit in the group chat um oh my god where is it then he started getting emails like talking about applying for like unemployment in kentucky it was like daryl this is now your primary email it, he basically just hacked all of his shit <laughs> and doing like stupid shit inconsistent shit. oh we summoned him i was tell i was telling them about how you got hacked <laughs> Kokomo has been summoned. <laughs> he was getting on YouTube to <laughs> It was Kansas? Oh he's he's setting the record straight. <laughs> How do I know this isn't Daryl I'm talking to right now? <laughs> Kokomo got on YouTube to support his friend. How nice. <laughs> it seems the Pokemon's been glimpsed on the other side of the rift. That was perfect timing, Coke. <laughs> do you do you mind if I say your name? Because it feels weird calling you Kokomo. <laughs> it seems a Pokemon's been glimpsed on the other side of the rift. One of those Ginkgo Guild merchants informed me that the Commander Kamado has raised a force, uh, not to survey the Pokemon, but to subdue it should the need arise. Of course. Yeah. So weren't they? So Joey, Joey is Kokomo. Weren't they in like? Weren't they in California applying for Kansas unemployment with your with your <laughs> with your email? It's so bizarre. Such a crazy story. Now, if if a Pokemon were true truly were to appear from beyond the rift, what would become of everyone, I wonder? Santa Clarita. You know, we need a dog's Daryl. <laughs> Has Daryl continued to hack you, Joey? Oh, wait, no, there's two Joeys. I guess I will call you Kokomo. <laughs> they immediately changed the email. So weird. Such a weird thing that happened. <laughs> don't, don't let Hisui's great vastness stop you, Jamie. Let's go get the final item we need. <laughs> call me Coco? Okay. <laughs> Is that your shorthand? You think Kokomo here stole someone else's info? Yo, it's all its all a big fucking conspiracy, dude. For all I know, Coco was just... Well, now I'm thinking about the VTuber if I call you Coco. <laughs> it was all a fucking conspiracy. It was actually just a long con to, to get sympathy from the group chat. That's the spirit. I'll come watch this historic moment unfold, too. Watch? <laughs> Is that all you really do? Remember, once you've sought the third lake and found out, found what's needed for the red chain, make for the shrouded ruins. Shrouded ruins. I know where like the cloudy ruins are because the game was like, no, you can't go in there. We won't let you do that. Ever since you made a new Discord, I've been, you've been thinking about <laughs> what if it was just Daryl the whole time? <laughs> uh. I've been keeping up on your old Discord account. It has not been getting online, so I think you're good. What were all the games that Daryl bought for you? I wish we could buy frickin' Ultra Balls, dude. That would be so hype. You deleted it? It says it still exists, though. Let's see if there's another mass out- No more mass outbreaks? Dang it. I don't know why we had such a chain there. You haven't recorded anything since Elden Ring? You make, uh, do you make gameplay videos, Big Waifu Sim? Pokemon Snap and Skyward Sword. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. <laughs> See ya, Big Waifu Simp. Enjoy the Elden Ringing. Let's get the hell out of here. Yo, I was only half paying attention in that cutscene. Are we like about about to fight Arceus or some shit? <laughs> Is that another Hippenny? 
Oh no, they're flowers. <laughs> oh! Okay. Damn. Shit is crazy. Oh, you do Genshin Gods. Ah. Yeah, I guess, you know, if, you, if you're cranking out a 500-day streak, you might as well do some Gods, right? Okay, ouch, that hurt. Yeah, see you, see you, Kokomo. Thanks for coming. Or Coco, whatever the hell. See you, dude. I'll catch you later. <laughs> Yo, Chinese food does sound kind of nice, though. I had a McGriddle for, for breakfast. <laughs> he was the guest star of the day. <laughs> they say this like used to be Volcano. That was such good timing. <laughs> then it erupted, leaving a huge crater that filled with water. And so Lake Verity was born. It is protected by a Pokemon called Mesprit. I thought Manphy was like one of these things. I don't know these Pokemon. Well, I know these Pokemon, but like I'm not familiar with them. I never caught them in any game, and I don't think I saw any of the movies that they were in. It was when Mesprit took flight that people first learned the joys and sorrows of living. Or that's how the old tales go, anyway. The cave has been opened. <laughs> he created depression. <laughs> then we must capture it. <laughs> I, I will weaponize it. What surprises wait within, I wonder. Mistress Kogita seemed quite intent that you would have to prove yourself to all three. This challenge was never meant for the fate of heart. So if I kill it, is everyone happy? Air feels somehow tense in here. Oh! It's, a uh... Gudra. Oh shit. I didn't heal my Pokemon. Oh, they got healed up automatically, I guess. Who do we want to lead with? Gudra is... Um, I know it's dragon type. Doesn't it have a secondary typing? Or am I crazy? Notification saying OBS disconnect. Are we back? Did the stream go down, you guys? I got a notification saying OBS disconnected. Am I here? It's good. Did the stream go down at all? It was a quick blip. Okay, that was the first time it ever happened. <laughs> on the old channel, I don't know what I did, but I fixed streaming because I I tried streaming on the BFL Reacts channel a few times and OBS would always fucking crash. But now that doesn't happen, so that's good, and that scared me, even though that was like nothing ever before. Um, so if it's part steel, we'll go right you. My, my, like, life flickered before my eyes for a second there. Does it say anything in OBS? It says, it doesn't even say drop frames or anything. I don't know. That's weird. Is that normal for OBS to do that? Right, choose the answer for everything. Well, I guess so. What? I thought I had. I thought I had the. This guy. Uh, whatever. Whatever. Level 58. Damn. <laughs> I'm not gonna write you a love song, Joey. You gotta do better than that. What the fuck did you just do? Was that a hydro pump? I, what what was it? The uh, 
The two Pidgey, one Geo, dude. That was a bit better than a Raichu a love song, I must say. I wonder if a oh, that's not very effective, isn't it? We got Agile style. Everybody's a critic. <laughs> Who sings that original version of that song? I don't remember. That's just like one of those vague early 2000 song memories for me <laughs> as a child. Yeah, we actually get to go. Let's go. Mr. Cold Fire. Sarah Barrails. Was she a one hit wonder? I have never heard that name in my life, dog. I, well, I don't know if Strong Style will kill. Oh, it's paralyzed. You had to look it up. <laughs> Hex should kill. No. Oh shit, it did just use Hydro Pump and it. It didn't kill. It used Hydro Pump and then I was like, alright, I'll put my fire type in. Alright, what. Which of these has the best. accuracy? Fuck. Let's go! How do I see my move accuracy, bro? Oh, X. Okay. Oh, damn. These are all 100 accuracy. Get flamethrown. Trash. Let's see the last one. I love my little Uggs. They're so cute. I feel as if there's no obstacle that can't be overcome if people and Pokemon work together. Let's see about the Pokemon of the lake. <laughs> hey! Cutie! What's good? Your emotions. Share them with me. Not a chance. Now they're yours. Now what is this? Is this just you press the prompt? When you fell this land, what stirred in your heart? <laughs> I, I think all three. Probably. Oh, I was a little surprised. I guess. How did it feel to bond with Pokemon and work together? Mystery Dungeon. The only Mystery Dungeon I ever played was, uh, I don't remember which one for the Game Boy. I actually have a mi No, I don't have the Mystery Dungeon for the Switch. I have the one for the 3DS that I played the very beginning of. I should get the one for the Switch, which is a remake. But that's okay with me. How did it feel to bond with Pokemon and work together? Exciting. What did you feel when you mingled with Hisui's clans? I don't know. Oh, then that must be a remake of the one I liked. When I got cast out of the Galaxy clan, I felt bitter. <laughs> They're being a bunch of bitches, bro. Take this piece of the spirit. Well, this one was easy. Switch remake was good. We have options now. <laughs> got with and without text box. I like the text box ones because it can be like you got and then you can put whatever you want in there. could just erase it and be like, you got no bitches. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, dude. You love the DS one. Had a fantastic story and slightly improved game feel. But the Switch one is nice. Yeah, I'll, I'll play it eventually. 
I need to. I want to play Pokemon Unite too. And obviously, I'm getting Kirby when that comes out. I might try Pokemon Unite out when uh, I finish this game because I'm gonna be done with this game, and Kirby doesn't come out until the 25th. So I might stream Pokemon Unite a couple times if I like it. And if I can even play an online game while streaming, I might not be able to. <laughs> but I think my internet's pretty great. You name your teammate in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Brosif? Sick. Mysterious, but I suppose when dealing with someone who fell from the sky, it's only natural to encounter mystery. Mystery Dungeon? Oh. That's all. Was that on screen the whole time? Is that why we were talking about Mystery Dungeon? I don't even know, bro. That's all three lakes behind us. I wonder what our next stop will bring. Uh, probably, like, the final boss. Why did I have to walk so, so long? What the hell? <laughs> the other one, the cave was way bigger, I feel. You missed the mystery dungeon chat? You can, you can still tog it up. Seems we finished the three lake trials. If I remember correctly, we're told to then head for Shrouded Ruins. I don't know what could await us there, but I'm always excited to explore some ancient ruins. Let's go. They're in the moisty mire. Ancient ruins is... Oh, that's where the cracked bell is, huh? I thought that that maybe had something to do with Spirit Tomb. Shrouded ruins. Oh, is that the symbol with all those Pokemon? Yeah. But that was there, like, in the Cobalt Coastlands, too. Mist is so very good at obscuring things. It's long been said to blur boundaries. If we're just somehow bring together the world of humans, the world of Pokemon, and the world of myth, then maybe we need a setting such as this. When are they going to make another Pokemon Rangers, dog? That being said, what are we meant to do now? Seems I've made it in time. Oh, it's the old lady. You arrived just when we dissembled all three gifts. Did you somehow see our progress across the distance dividing us? I had the aid of a rather remarkable Pokemon, if you really wish to know. Could you mean that Pokemon that flits about the Hisui region? What do you mean, that Pokemon that flits around the Hisui region? What does that mean? <laughs> but never mind that now. What about the red chain? How are we to forge it? I would hardly know. You speak of a divine instrument, one said to be capable of binding the very world. You really imagine it can be forged by human hands? And what are we to do? Search the entire vastness of Hisui for the answer? There was a sound cue. Hey, there they are. The Pokemon of the Lakes! They're glowing red, that probably means red chain is forming. It's the squad. Oh. It's a shiny comfy. So it was true, the pact our people have passed down for all these generations has been kept. At last, I can set this burden aside. Is that what those Pokemon do in all the games? Is just guard shit? <laughs> you succeeded once again, Jamie. Yet, things do not seem to be going so well for the rest of the world. What have you heard now? Is there sworn duty? Sure. I've had... I've. I've had some news from my fellow merchants in the Ginkgo Guild. It seems that the commander is going to forego waiting for our investigation to finish. He plans to climb Mount Coronet himself. Let him. I don't care. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna get up a, all up in that rift. <laughs> hey, yo. Well, he doesn't know yet that our Jamie has managed to get the red chain now, does he? That's true. There's no way he could. You need to tell him about the chain, about everything Jamie has achieved before he sets out. Bro, I feel like any, literally anyone could have gotten any of those things. 
Like, it's basic Pokemon trivia, just like, hey, how, how was your day today? And, like, throw things at this guy for, like, two minutes. You don't even need to hit him or be close. <laughs> you can't be here. <laughs> Thank goodness you're still alive, though. I mean, of, of course you are. I knew you'd be all right. Wait one second. I'll go let the captain and the professor know you're back. It's in your name? I... I guess, yeah. <laughs> Most people aren't given a tool from God. Fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> oh, my dear Jamie. Professor, I know you've been worried about Jamie, but there's no need to cry. I, I'm not crying. Don't mock your elders if you please, Ray. <laughs> And besides, weren't you the one who couldn't get a wink of sleep from all your worrying over our friend? Y'all, I was gone for like 30 minutes. Just ignore him, Jamie. Anyway, where's Captain Silene? Wasn't she coming with you, Professor? She's buried under a mound of work. It seems her hands are more, more than full now that Commander Kamado's gone. Didn't we already know he was gone? So why do I have to ask? Didn't he just tell us that? Determined to handle the whole space-time rift business himself. A Pokemon that's been spotted on the other side. I'm thinking that's four potential Pokemon. <laughs> and since I'm such a fine fellow, I took over watching the gate for the security core folks. Well, we aren't getting anywhere out here. Let's head inside and report to the captain. Oh, we were trying to catch him before he left? Okay, I just misunderstood. I thought they said he was already <laughs> on his way. He managed not to die, just as I ordered. Well done. Why would it be thanks to her? The fuck? No, I owe it to Irida. Before moving forward, I must ask. I assume that you were here again because you've managed to learn something of use? I got this red chain, you see... Go on. <laughs> you explain about the red chain. Hmm. Commander Kamado is no longer here. Yeah, I, I got it. I got that. They reported sightings of something on the other side of the space timer. Something that resembled a Pokemon. Commander made the decision to take the security cord to the mountain so as to prepare to fend off any possible threat. People can't even catch like a Pidgey. They were to make for the temple at the peak. The boss may be tough, but it still seems like a bad idea to do something so risky without Jamie's help. She did let us use the pastures? Yeah, I guess, but I didn't, I didn't like, use the pastures. <laughs> <laughs> and I used the camp before she said I could use the camps. <laughs> As the captain of the survey. As soon as I got kicked out of town, the first thing, last stream, the first thing I did was go to a camp. <laughs> As the captain of the survey corps, I hereby order you to proceed as follows. Jamie, take that red chain to the mountain, make your way to the peak, and put an end to all this. Okay, can you look at my Pokedex? I kind of caught a bunch of stuff. Hmm. If he didn't wish me to decide things at his place, he should not have left me in charge. There you go, girl. That's a girl boss mindset. And I'll go as well. We're all in this together, we members of the Survey Corps. Naturally. Oh. Oh, new side mission for some reason. Okay. Oh! Lucario has a side mission for me? <laughs> what? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I don't understand you. Something the matter, Lucario? Ah, uh, you look edgy. Edgy enough for Lucario. I'm Rai. <laughs> and you are? It's Ryan's toy reviews, all grown up. 
roof. What is it, Lucario? Drew? Seems he sensed my strong aura. Oh, yeah. I'll beat y'all's ass. That. Oh, there's someone down the fucking basement. Oh, my God. So many side missions. Wait, why are they giving me side missions? Wouldn't they still think I'm evil? <laughs> Might I trouble you to help me with a little survey work? Some ancestor that lived in a village around the avalanche slopes, but I've never been able to find any hint of such a settlement existing. Beginning to doubt the tales, but everyone wants to know where they came from, don't they? So help me out. If you can find any evidence people ever lived around the avalanche slopes. Okay. Oh, uh, you want me to watch the Clefairy? Investigate whether Clefairy dance. Okay. That sounds like a fun mission. I still want to do back alley Mr. Mine. I'm, I'm just collecting them all. I want to do all the side missions, but we'll worry about these after we finish. I'm still wondering what the hell this thing is. A uh, bit of help from Blissey. Speak with Pippa about the incident. Do your utmost to be of help, if you would. Okay. <sighs> Do I want more satchel space? How much? If it's more than half? No. Okay. You're cutting it close there, though, Baggin. Thank you, Baggin. No. Absolutely not. Yeah, I mean... On the Walk of Shame, everyone, like, really varies between looking sad... Oh, you want magic card. They vary between, like, looking sad and, like... Being like, oh, I always fucking hated that guy. Should we just, you know, buy $10,000 worth of iron chunks? Now, what recipes do you have? Ox evasion. There's a, get them. Oh, we don't have enough money. Oh well. <laughs> oh, we don't have the enough tumble stones. Damn. What? Why do we not have enough tumble stones, bro? Give me some tumble stones. How much stardust I got? Probably a lot, because it's better to uh, make you know. You really, like, I always hated that guy. I don't even know what it was. I, <laughs> I got a lot of Stardust because I prefer making, using it with the plates to make, like, star pieces or whatever. Which I actually might be able to make. No. I need blue and green shards. Yeah. They're like a Twitter user when someone gets cancelled. Oh, I always got sus vibes from them. You know? I never really liked their content. I'm good. I'm also good on that shit. Alright, let's go, let's go. Story. Actually, one more thing. Actually, no, we'll do it, we'll do it. I was gonna talk to that little creepy girl and see if she would give me anything for wisps. How could a grown man like Commander Kamado be so reckless? <laughs> yeah, I just slip berries into her dress when she isn't looking. <laughs> Aren't grown men usually the most reckless? I don't know. I, be I would believe that a man would be reckless. 
As the leader of the Pearl Clan, loyal to Almighty Sinnoh who reigns over all space, I can go anywhere in Vast Isui as I please. And now, I'm going to stop the commander. Okay. Huh, who's the reckless one? Ew. The Magikarp girl. Hey, you got run out of the village, right? But you still try to find a way to help us all? Bro, if it were me, I'd be like, fuck y'all. <laughs> y'all are all a bunch of... Y'all are on some shit. Jamie worked hard to get that red chain to help everybody. Too right, and a fine job she did. Here, take this. Better be something good. Okay, that's okay, I guess. We said something to them, and it made them run away. <laughs> I'd like to imagine that my character threatened that child, and then sent them running in fear. Make for the summit camp, and the Temple of Sinnoh. Use the red chain, and return alive. Gotcha. How long have we been streaming? Uh, two hours and we've done uh, 30 minutes worth of story. <laughs> On the finale. Uh, the, well, the main story finale. I've heard the latest. So you've accepted back in the galaxy team, have you? Next time bring me five max revive, you little trash child. <laughs> you little crotch goblin. <laughs> Oh, when does Mario Kart DLC drop, guys? Isn't it? Is it? It's a March twenty eighth. It's March something. Because I'd like to stream that too. But I feel like Kirby takes priority. I've heard the latest. So you've been accepted back in the Galaxy Team, have you? I suppose congrats are in order. Here are some max potions for me to celebrate. Thanks. Looks like the big moment is upon us at last, but no doubt it'll be fine. After all, you worked so hard during that red chain. Uh, Adam and Irida are up there. Wish you great fortune. We would truly regret losing one of our most loyal and beloved customers. March 18th? That's a week before uh, Kirby, right? In Kirby 25th? Seems... But it's the day before Owl House and Amphibia. Damn. Oh well. Yeah, it, it uh, seems Commodo intends to use the Summit Camp as a base of operations for this undertaking. As for me, I think it will set up shop closer to the temple itself. Too much content, right? I feel like I might have to do a short stream at night after work, even though I, I don't really like filming or anything after work. I feel like I might have to, because I feel like if I go the entirety of, like, Outhouse Amphibia finishing up their seasons without streaming, I feel like I'll forget how to stream. <laughs> Things certainly seem to have gotten out of hand. Well, if anything goes wrong, the Great Melly will be here, for moral support at least. I don't care, bro. Don't I have some max revives in here? I have a single revive. Got a potion. I do have hella stardust, dude. That is kind of crazy. I didn't realize. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Full restores feel pointless. Yeah, I knew I had some max revives. Um, no mass outbreaks. <laughs> Stardust tastes like pixie sticks. Uh, what flavor of pixie sticks? If Stardust tastes like pixie sticks, then the do star pieces taste? I don't have Rotom. Then do star pieces taste like Smarties? This is the first time I've seen Rotom, bro. Good 
Go get it. Oh, goddamn. You fast bitch. You need to catch it. Alright, battle. It doesn't run away, does it? Smoking smarties? That's for like... <laughs> that's for the white kids that live in gated communities. Real... <laughs> Real OGs were snorting smarties, bro. Shit. <laughs> well, hold up. I have the microwave and the lawnmower. For Rotom. Oh, thank goodness, you passed by. Please, I need you to rescue my spiel. What the fuck? It's rolling down the hill. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Used to chew the plastic when you were done. What the fuck? Why? <laughs> no hate. I'm just curious. Ah, uh, is this what the... Oh, so this is what the... The Cloudy Pass is all about. I, that was a freaking Ultra Ball. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yeah... Oh, I'm so dumb. I bought a bunch of tumble stones and iron chunks and then didn't make any balls with them. Bruh Momento? Make 20. Used to buy those large Smarties and then crush them up. God. Chill, Joe. <laughs> Take it easy, bro. That's... That's degenerate behavior. You're about to go down a dangerous life path with that. Um, <laughs> uh, that just like de totally derailed my train of thought. Uh, I have no clue what I was gonna say. I don't know what I was gonna say, bro. I was supposed to follow that up. Oh, there's baby. No, Smarties are not chocolate. They're kind of like a chalky sugar. <laughs> Damn, that thing's a level 55. That's kind of crazy. Ow, what the? You just ran up and punched me, bro. We got the baby. That's one baby down. Need to throw more. I'm scared that might despawn. I just want to hit him with a single gigaton. See what that does. And you, you, you get a great ball. Yo, it, it worked. Sick. Yeah, chalky sugar is a good description. <laughs> They're like M and M's. Interesting. I think I've. I think you've mentioned that. <laughs> I think you've mentioned that in the comment section of mine once before. What the hell is this green? Why is it green? Oh, it's like Aurora Borealis. What is that red down there? What is that red? I don't know. I don't care. Get me the hell out of here. And I'll take a tumble stone. And I'll take a tumble stone. And I'll take a tumble stone. <laughs> mm. Not far to go. 
<laughs> I took that tumble stone. What are you? Oh, that's a person. He's gonna fight me, isn't he, Melly? Oh wait, this isn't Melly. Who the hell is this? They like to use green as a supplement in color. Yeah, like the water, I guess. Oh no! Does he have potato mochi? What? I'd much rather be there now, serving up some freshly grilled potato mochi. But that task matter, Kamado has gone and left me to oversee our food supply. What is this music coming in? Yo, let me crank it. He always finds a way to put even these old bones to work. While I'm handling that, I suppose I'll handle you as well? Time we got rid of you once and for all, he never liked me, dude. He knew I hated the potato mochi. I don't understand. <laughs> I'll make myself plain. As Commodo's right hand, I'm charged with executing all the gritty deeds Commodo can't or won't do himself. I gave him my word I'd get rid of any fools that might dream of getting in the way of his plans. And besides, it's not just- this is the biggest plot twist ever, dude. And besides, it's not just Kamado who longs to live in a new home, free of fear or strife. His dream is mine now, too. You've seen my smoke bombs before, right? Well, this is how you're meant to use them. What? <laughs> when I heard you managed to quell those nobles one after another, oh boy, did it ever make my blood run hot. And my heart pound. At last, at last. He's a ninja! One final opponent worthy of my great ninja techniques that have been left to molder all of these long years. Bro, he's got four Pokemon! Ms. Magius. Alright, this might be the best character in the game. That, that's, that's pretty great. <laughs> What level is it? 59? Okay. A little scary. But we crunched those. What else you got? Quick attack, dirty. Close combat, bro. Yo, what kind of Pokemon is that? What even is this typing? <laughs> it's probably ice. Not very effective. Super effective aerial ace. Ground type? No. Fighting? Poison fighting? Interesting. Okay. Well, we get to go twice, so... Okay. Oh, wow. He got wrecked. Good job, Crobat. Ardevoir. Really? Ray said that? I don't remember. <laughs> Iron Tail. Oh, but he's dead. Now it's your chance. Typhlosion! I don't think I've used Shadow Ball. Use it. Oh. That's kind of cool looking. Oh. It held on. But it wasn't enough. Let's go. During the Mirelands? Interesting, bro. And a Gallade. Ooh. Ah. Oh. 
Oh, that did nothing. Okay. Oh, he's, he's setting up on me, bro. <laughs> you are... Well... I don't want to go strong style and then be... Like, fuck. We'll just go normal. I don't have Typhlosion signature move? What is it? What is it? <laughs> I, I feel like I was like, I'd rather have Hex. <laughs> I'd rather have Hex. <laughs> what is the signature move? Now, now, now I'm curious. <laughs> It, seem, it seems my, my ninja techniques will soon be consigned. The history. Is it overheat? Very good, young one. Very good indeed. It's just better hex. <laughs> I'll check that out. It's, if it's only a foolish ninja who... I don't battle much in this game, to be completely honest. It's only a foolish ninja who tries to keep after a target they know they cannot beat. And to be honest, I don't hate you. I hate you, bro. Listen well, Jamie. Pokemon are truly terrifying. Shut up, dude. The Pokemon burned your village down? <laughs> what, am I supposed to cry? Oh, your friends died? Boo-hoo. That's why Kamado came here to Hisui, to try and colonize the lands. Where people could live free from fear. As long as they looked like us. But to achieve something truly great, your Pokemon have to take extreme actions. If, hypo hi hi if hypothetical as it may be, a Pokemon were to appear from within this space-time rift, Kamado might lose hold of his reason. Save Kamado from himself, by force if you must. Are you going to heal my Pokemon? I do not want more Potato Mochi. I'm going to go into that rift and kill myself so I don't have to ever eat your Mochi again. My god. My Pokemon are back. Apparently I've been lacking on you, Typhlosion. Well, it has less power than... Uh, see you, Duckverse. It has less power than H Hex. But it do it can potentially burn. I guess. I guess I'll use it. I, th I feel like what probably happened is I, I saw it and I, I was like, that does less power. And I didn't even know it did, uh, it could potentially do burn. It's, I didn't notice that part, so I probably was like, why would I ever do that? It's on stream somewhere. Alright. The big moment. Let's save. Along took us 36 hours to get here. Pretty good. Pretty good length. Well, oh, that was cool. That was a cool whoosh, pan down. I like that. Are we going to have to buy trainers to walk up there? Oh. Oh, damn it. <laughs> How cool would that have been? Now, who are you? Oh, that's Volo. Ooh. I'll buy a couple of them. Just because I'm scared. I feel like the upcharge is a bit ridiculous. We can actually buy a couple Ultra Ball. Oh, damn. Never mind. Get the hell out of here. Better take that red chain up to the top of the mountain. That Pokemon threatening to descend on the peak any moment now. I th think it may be Almighty Sinnoh. So is it going to be like Dialga and Palkia? Or is it going to be Arceus? 
All this has to be stopped, and you're the only one who can do it. Almighty Seno seems to be nearly here, but still, the commander obstructs us. The dogs are going crazy. I think my grandparents are getting home from the store. So the dogs are going to be barking for like five minutes while my grandparents <laughs> make their way inside. Oh, hello. Oh. It's probably the worst time for the dogs to start going crazy. <laughs> oh well. Why? Where did he get this armor? Why are you wearing armor? I don't know. This dude's about to play some Elden Ring. I've heard that this red chain of yours will bind the world. I assume that to bind the world means to hold the world together, keeping it as it's meant to be. A welcome idea, but can I truly put my faith in such tales? Trust me. He's gonna be like, no, we got a battle. Eh, I have two Pokemon. Commander? Stop. I understand that you're bound to protect your people. I have the same duty. But doubting Jamie, you're not just wrong, you're a dumbass. Perhaps you're right. But if I were simply to place my faith in her, and that faith were to betrayed, be betrayed, then how could I possibly face my people? You may think you're the only one desperate to protect the people of Jubilife, but you're not! Jamie's putting her life on the line as well. Fine, enough. Let fate decide what happens next. Whichever of us is stronger will prevail. I was <laughs> about to throw hands with God. <laughs> he doesn't... Uh, I, get, I guess he knows that. Face me with your Pokemon. Yeah, we're gonna... I'm not worried. I'm worried about what's after. Maybe I should be worried, actually. I'm not worried about who he is as a person, but for what this means for the story, it is actually perhaps worrying. Braviary? What is this bitch, like, psychic? And you're dead. Hopefully you're dead? Yeah, I should have seen if I could could have got a second. Oh well, he used up his max potion. I should have seen if I could have got a sm a second move on anything doing agile. Well, we know that that doesn't kill, so we'll just hit a quick light crunch. The dog just barked directly outside my door. I think someone's in the bathroom. Uh, we'll just hit a normal crunch real quick. <laughs> Snorlax? Get him, Toxicroak. <clears throat> yeah, because Toxicroak knows close combat. Okay. Damn. Get the poison off on this guy. Oh wait, it's gonna be super effective. I'm dumb. Put him to sleep. <laughs> I'm stupid. No! Well, if he doesn't insta-kill me, I can leech life and get a good amount back. Just strong cross poison. It's not gonna do a ton. It did pretty good, though. Yeah. I'm stupid. I don't know why I switched him in. It didn't kill the- Wait, wait. It said he only- It said he could only go once! It said he could go once. Am I, am I dumb? Did I did I misread that? What? I swear it said if I went strong style, he could only go once.
Wait, won't they be super effective against Typhlosion too? Oh my god, bro. <laughs> my team, well, we, we killed him. My team gets messed up by Psychics. God damn. What else you got, bro? Golem? Oh my god. Bro, we're kind of getting bodied. A second time, bro? Oh my god. Okay, Gyarados. You're a flying type, but you can also hit that strong MF Aqua Tail. I don't know which would be better, a Hydro Pump or an Aqua Tail. Oh, we can go twice, so it doesn't matter. A normal Aqua Tail one shot at him. <laughs> it's four times effective. I, I forgot that it was rock ground. But Fable. This creature. It scares me. This is a normal Aqua Tail. Oh no, what are you doing? Calm mind? Oh god, it's setting up, bro. Stop that. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Please. Someone let me go twice. Well, if we don't die instantly, we get to go twice afterwards, so... I think that's the right choice. Damn. That doesn't kill, that doesn't kill, so now we can go twice. Okay, and its stats are back down. Very good, very good. Maybe we'd be better off with... A special attack? I don't know what it... What Clefable's stats are, you know, physical versus... Versus special. <laughs> My god, dude. Listen to with a normal Hydro Pump. Yeah, seems like special would be the way to go. What are you doing? Call mind again? Oh, psychic. So you can go twice. Kill me. Well, you didn't kill, idiot. And now, you're dead. Assuming this doesn't miss. Go tell that to the mochi man. Son? Little thought. <laughs> Any Pokemon that threatens our life here must be eliminated. Eliminated? He wants to kill God, bro? That's crazy. I respect you for that, though. I do. You truly are a force to be reckoned with. Hey, he castrated himself. Is that the right word? I hope it is. Uh, Jamie, the fates have decided. I concede, and I apologize sincerely for doubting you. Because I know a different meaning for the word castrate. But doesn't it also mean to humble yourself? Or did I just say something extremely out of pocket? Everyone is extremely shocked to see this. Understandably so. He is saying sorry. Commander? I know I have no right to ask, of it, ask it of you any longer, but please use that strength of yours for the sake of the Gal Galaxy Expedition Team. No. For the sake of the Celestica people and all the Pokemon living in Hisui. That... Don't worry, Commander. We've got the red chain. Let's get it. Is everyone healed up? Man, this game doesn't even offer, like, a in-game reason for why you get healed up. It's just like, you're good now. Now, who are you people? Oh, you're the lady.
Hold up. <laughs> I'm about to kill myself in here. I was wondering if you could climb that. Oh! Okay, so I was right. Okay. I thought it meant that, but I was like, okay, does it does it mean that? Or is there another word? Oh. It can also be seen as out of pocket. You can interpret that as you will. <laughs> well, that's a big arena. Big platform. Come on, now's the time. Use the red chain. Wait, what, what is this? There's a voice in my head. It's speaking to me. You hold the red chain. Try to catch me then. Uh-oh. Almighty Sinnoh may be speaking to me. It's telling me... Try to catch me then, for the fight to come. Who is it? Give me some balls. Ten, only ten? Now, who is Almighty Sinnoh? Is it Palkia? Is it Diaga? Is it Arceus? Potentially, like, Giratina or something? Yeah, I'm curious to see. That's an evil theme. Is it Giratina? That looks like, uh, that one's Palkia, I think. What's up, dragon? Oh, damn. Stone Cold's theme song kicks in. <laughs> it is a big creature. I thought that they looked, uh... What's going to happen to make it change form? Because I know what the other... Other way they look is. Um, oh great, we're a perfect level for this. He's so big. Oh, he's, he won't look at me. He's disgusted. Ew, you can see up in his mouth. I don't like the inside of his mouth. <laughs> Ew, I, I kind of like his tail. It looks fun. Ow, okay. Well, he's like, he's sick of my shit. Okay, un understood, buddy. He says stop fucking around, bro. Damn, quick attack. Don't do much, but it gives me a lot to work with later. Okay. And we'll quick attack then. Hey, that was pretty good. Uh oh. Well, he killed me, so never mind. <laughs> I don't even know what type this thing is, bro. Effective, effective. Everything's just effective. <laughs> I didn't know it knew Earth Power. <laughs> Else I would have paralyzed him. What are you? Water dragon? Damn. Okay, okay. Uh. Be close combat? I mean, we're not gonna kill him instantly. So I think a poison shock. Or jab is pretty good. Damn, this guy's kind of a pussy. Oh wait, yeah. That is super effective against him, huh? Perhaps I should have considered that. We'll get a couple crunches in. The potato mochi man? Dude, I was so surprised, Dragon. That was crazy. And my jaw dropped. <laughs> Let's just hit a normal crunch. Yo, Palkia kinda weak though. I mean, sure it is one-shotting every Pokemon, except for Floatzel. It somehow held on. 
I think that's a catch. It's easy. That was easy. Ooh. Give me a challenge. Give me something hard, bro. Dialga now? That one was Palkia, right? <laughs> I never finished the Gen 4 games. <laughs> the red chain's been shattered, but we still got the Pokemon of the Lakes to thank for getting this far. Oh, well done, Jamie, my girl. Masterfully handled. I was watching the whole time. You truly are the pride of the Survey Corps. It's all because she had me to show her the ropes when she first got here. I literally forgot you were a character, bro. Uh, I can hear Almighty Sinnoh. No, it's it's called Palkia. Palkia speaking to me in my mind. Yeah, it did quite literally ask me to catch it. That is true. And why do you make me fight him? <laughs> Have I not proved myself worthy enough already? Space-time grows chaotic. The power fails. The frenzied one. It comes now to fight. The frenzied one. Uh-oh. <laughs> Is that Dialga? But th the red chain smashed to bits. No way even Jamie could tackle another Pokemon as strong as the last one now. Oh, did the red chain make me stronger? Is, Is that some lore? Uh oh. Ooh. <laughs> Kamado is having a fit over there. Oh, wait, are we running away? What? Fight it. Okay. We blew the cutscene budget. All of you. We must vacate this. Gah, forget the fancy talk. Book it. Come on. We gotta make it back to Summer Camp while we still can. We need to leave before the Almighty Sinner decides I want to fight the other Almighty Sinner. Who wants the, the fight? We need the chain to fight it? Who? Fuck it. Fuck a chain, bro. You dunce. You won't be any use to anybody if you die up here on this mountain. What are you waiting for? I'm telling you. We gotta get gone. Ooh. Bro, I thought that was the end of the game. <laughs> Shit. Such dreadful power. It's certainly beyond our current capabilities. To... Bro, how much, how much more is there, dude? I'm amazed you even managed to stay on your feet before, Jamie. Did you, did you notice the energy pouring out of the rift? It seems likely the build-up of the same energy was caused strange lightning through the noble Pokemon of their frenzy states. <sighs> so our two clans truly were different. For a different Sinnoh, but both were real. What a shocking turn of events. Yeah, I couldn't have seen this coming. They'll say nothing of the shock of hearing the commander speak so differently. I must apologize from the bottom of my heart to both of you as fellow leaders. You saw the truth that I cannot. You never abandoned your trust in Jamie. And to you, Jamie. I acted on ill-considered pre pre presumptions and drove you from the Galaxy Expedition Team, forcing you to face great hardship alone. And despite all that, you still strove to save all of Hisui. Yep. Well, it's not like we'd just sit back and ignore a space-time rift. And we understood, Commander, that you had reasons to act as you did. Commander Maya has just returned, re returned to the matter at hand, left things in quite a state up at the temple. That's the stuff, Mr. Professor. You'd rather face what's in front of us than dwell on the past, huh? They sent us back to camp so we could put Palkia on our team, didn't they? A, de a dependable attitude, indeed. Yes, let's move on. No need to speak any further about my rash actions, not to mention my loss of composure. It seems that having Jamie about, about has been a good influence after all. That's only natural. Jamie is strong enough to defeat even this new opponent single-handedly. Yeah. Did you forget the red chain broke? We are right, armed with the knowledge Mal Palkia imparted on me. Palkia? That Pokemon that talked to you? Yeah, it told me its name, but that's not all. Uh, talking so fast is making me have to burp. <laughs> the stone of creation's beginning, the chain of red, the vessel of humankind's invention. Unite these three and calm the chaos now disturbing the flow of time. And then Mighty Palkia must go back with us to the temple, it said. Well, that chain of red is in pieces now, but if little bits will do, I gathered those. And the vessel of humankind's invention, I dare say that might refer to a Pokeball. We're we gonna make a Master Ball? <laughs> 
Stone of Creation's beginning. Leon might have an idea. He's knowledgeable about stones and minerals. He even goes digging for ore sometimes. Who the hell is Leon? Is that the little hat boy? Warden Leon will be a fine resource to consult. What are your thoughts, Professor Lavington? Do you have any idea what the stone could be? Ew, that face. Uh, upon my word, perhaps I do. Jamie, my girl. Could you lend me those plates you received? Uh, of course, the plates. The ones that Volu said have messages engraved upon them. Bro, if I knew there was so much more, I probably wouldn't have been fucking around with the mass outbreaks for so long. <laughs> Just as I remembered. Here on the back of the Earth plate, it says, When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. I think this may be a hint to what we need. How do you mean? Don't you see? We must search for stone, or rather, ore, I suppose, that shares... Well, do I need to find 11 ore that shares the same material properties? In fact, I believe that young Liam might know just where to find such a thing, as he'd been investigating it at Volo's urging. Now that you mention it, that Volo fellow has come around the Diamond Settlement and asked about this place before, too. That seems like a lead worth following. It's decided, then. This begins our search for Stone of Creation's beginning, although the name is a rather mouthful. Wouldn't you say? I propose we call it Origin Ore. Uh, okay. What was the name of the mission before this? It's the name of the stream. What is the stream titled? <laughs> Here, Doug, may I ask for your clan's aid once more? I need to go to the bathroom, okay? That's why I was reading fast. I'll be right back. I can't hold it. It's hard out here, man. It's hard. I'll be right back. I have returned. I needed to stretch my legs anyways. How long have I been live? Sitting for three hours is not good for you. I mean, I do do that regularly, but that doesn't mean I should. Oh, she's calling him to the camp. Thank God we don't have to go find him. I waited as long as anyone can reasonably expect but my invitation. No one invited Melly. <laughs> so I decided to honor you all with an unsolicited visit. Be glad and rejoice. Did anyone say anything while I was uh, using the restroom? Yeah, chair stream, of course. Chair cam. I decided to honor you all with an Oh uh, yeah, I already read that. <laughs> now, Adamin, I see all these other louts have their little tasks to be getting on with. But what of the great Melly? Where's my role in all this? 
his face. He's like, fuck you, bro. Show a shred of respect, would you? Fine, whatever. Just hurry up and give me a job, great leader Adaman, and make it a good one. You want a job? Fine. Your job is to shut the hell up. All the other wardens are busy looking after their nobles and keeping their people of our clans from panicking. Take a hint, dude. Oh, Adaman. Oh, 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 you silly, foolish boy. Don't you understand anything? Everyone has work they are suited to and work they are not. Oh, before I forget, it seems you weren't entirely used to this after all, Team Galaxy grunt. Well done. I caught God, bro. One of them. <laughs> Take this as a reward. Just my way of encouraging the little people. You're all so little compared to me. <laughs> okay, dude. Is he gonna give me, like, a normal Pokeball? <laughs> Three candy truffles? Get the fuck out of here, bro. Get him. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. I think I hit the mic, but I... Come on, bro. I brought Leon. Let's go. I like this little dude. Hey, hey, don't come after the hat, Melly. That is too far. <laughs> that ugly hat suits you as poorly as this important role does. I don't like this at all. I should be the one consulted for my wisdom. Roast his ass, Leon. Isui's ores and stones are her precious resource. Since I was the first to realize that fact, it's only natural that I should be the first consulted. If you have a problem with it, perhaps you'd like to take it up with Cleaver and battle? That bumbling ball of yours? Oh shit. Pit the nobles against each other. Excuse me? That bumbling ball is more than capable of zapping both you and that ugly bug of yours all the way back to your stupidly oversized tree. Shall we prove it to you now? Melly, give it a rest and play nice with the Pearl Clan folks. Bigger things are at stake here. But Adamin! Everyone back home is all worked up because the Pearl Clan got to speak to Almighty Sinnoh, or Palkia, or whatever. Do you want them to hog all the glory? So Palkia came up with its own name. Warden Leon, if you would. Certainly. Then let us set out at once. We make for Primeval Grotto. That's where that lady had us at, right? Oh, no, it is making us go there. Well, then why did you bring him here? Damn it. <laughs> oh, no, it is here. It's here. Okay. <laughs> okay. Any shinies for my trouble? Any shinies for my trouble? No. Understandable. Sp spare shinies. Oh. He really does just stand there. He doesn't care at all. I like his energy. More people should have that energy. Something's coming at me. Uh oh. He finally noticed me. <laughs> Man, he's stupid. Oh, are you actively mad at me? I misread the situation. Where is it? Oh, is it in here? Get the hell out of here, bro. Oh, I never... Did I ever come in here? What the hell? I don't remember this place. Okay. Is there anything else in here besides just... I don't want to deal with that. Okay. Okay. What are these? Oh, the shield on. And, uh... The other one. With the head. Hmm, it looks to be red footprints on the wall. Curious. It said curious. I feel some extraordinary power here, as if the world itself was created in this very place. What? What 
you think, Leon? Don't worry. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I was looking for something. Taking into consideration my knowledge of the ores, my skill at mining, and the strength of my sligoose moves, I think you better leave any extraction work up to us. Alright, kid. Whatever you say. Oh, God. Is it the sisters? <laughs> oh, come on. Who's there? We don't have any time to waste with... Clover? Oh. We haven't seen you since you walked out of the clan. Where have you been all this time? Huh. <laughs> I don't have to tell you nothing. Why she make that face? Look, you can carry on digging out what treasure you're after, and then you'll give it to us. I don't know why you even look surprised. It's not as if you were hard to follow. What we seek may be as precious as treasure, but this isn't about how valuable it is. We need it to restore this awful sky to normal. I love her design so much. Ugh, that earnest goody two-shoes act of yours is what made me leave the Pearl Clan in the first place. Enough. I don't care about any of this that's going on. Why are you three here? <laughs> there are three of you and three of us. Let's go, Jamie. You take charm. <laughs> okay. She can be strong, probably. I bring good luck to my sisters wherever I go, and ill luck to anyone who crosses our path. I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm. Okay. Let's go. Oh, man. I didn't put Palkia on my team. level is it? 61. Get out of here, you idiot. Damn, Hydro Pump is cool. <laughs> Ugh. Ouch. A crit? Oh my god, that shit hurt. That shit hurt it. Make it strong, baby. Crunch his ass. Let's go. That Gengar did a lot of damage, though. That was crazy. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. Well, you are rather formidable. Level up, baby. Let's go. Come on, Clover. Why not come back to the Diamond Clan? Times are changing, we're changing, and we we could really use someone as strong as you are. Are you joking? I've got no interest in living back in that place without stupid rules. Look, we'll let you keep your treasure this time, but you better do something about that sky. We're trying, bro. <laughs> You're as strong as ever, Jamie. Maybe you really can do something about that monstrous creature at the top of the mountain. But even if you do, the next time we meet, you won't escape without a beating. Remember that. They've been trained by the Mochi Man. <laughs> Honestly, those three, what, why were they even here? It's like they were padding for time. I'll heal everyone. <laughs> like, the fact that your Pokemon get automatically healed all the time makes it weird that he's like, I'll heal you guys, right? Like, either always give a reason or never give a reason. The coin I remember never hesitated to help someone in need, even if she groused as she did so. I suspect they may have been worried about us. Aw, perhaps even wanting to help. But then they got here and they couldn't look soft. I like that. She should have just said so. What a pain they are, hiding behind all that attitude. Damn, that's that Sligoo is tiny. I've only seen Alpha once. <laughs> I was able to extract some of the origin ore. I suppose I'd better go with you, Jamie. Sure. Ouch. So we're gonna use it to craft a master ball, right? That was easy. No, you simply failed to recognize my skill. 
You ought to be praising me, honestly. I knew we'd count on you, Leon. No wonder Cleaver recognizes you as a worthy warden. Let's head back to Mr. Professor and show him what we got. That Lavington's got sound judgment, plus knowledge to spare. Despite his silly streak. Oh, there's the proto bass. I do want to catch him. Probo bass, not proto bass. <laughs> all right, that's all you get. That dude is hard as hell to catch. I will say that. How many times have I hit him with a giga tump ball? The Sneezler prompt is everywhere, bro. I accidentally climb trees when I'm trying to pick mushrooms. Get me the hell out of here. But if you could give me a single shiny, I would I would really appreciate that. I scared the hell out of myself when I first time I climbed a tree with Sneasler. <sighs> Where's the space-time distortion? If we go over here and it auto-triggers the cutscene, we won't worry about it. It's not. We're gonna check out the space-time distortion. We got a lot of shit in here. Have I done one in this area? I don't even know if I did any in this area. I just want to get a shiny in the space time distortion. Is that too much to ask? Like, really? Yo, let me put the alga on my team. Or Palkia. Whatever. <laughs> oh, we did. Oh, you're right. You're right. We did do the one. We only did one, though. And I want to see. I kind of want to see Palkia in action. Well, we're gonna move him down here. I like never use legendaries. We're gonna grab Rotom and pull him down here too. Cause I want to. I want to get Rotom out and maybe not right now, but I'm just gonna put Palky on the. Do I even want Palky on the team? I really don't. I kind of want to for story like purposes though, right? Oh god, I wonder what his stuff in the Pokedex is actually. What's well, in the Cobalt Coastland? Oh, no, it's in the Coronet Highlands. <laughs> Nothing? I mean, this is where we found them. Is he in here? I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Oh. Use Aqua Tail, Spatial Ren, Strong Style, Agile Style. Sure. I just I want to get a break from all the cutscenes, so we're gonna we're gonna do a single based on distortion, and we also need more plates to be honest. We do need more more plates. Oh yeah, your spiel. It sucks to suck. Is there a Rotom down here? Spare Rotom? No.
We were going to do a space-time distortion earlier. And I don't know if a Magneton will spawn in here. Or Magnemite. But we really need Magnemite. To be honest. Do shinies have a higher percent chance to spawn in distortions? Because I feel like they should. Oh, the distortion has already started, probably. Oh, uh, no, actually, I think that that's just a scripted shiny Steelix, isn't it? We already caught it. I think. <laughs> we'll hit him with a jet ball. Just for the fuck of it. Get bonked, idiot. <laughs> you too, get bonked. Oh, it actually hit him. Let's go. <laughs> onyx acquired. He was a large Onyx. Uh, I don't want to deal with it if it's like that. That yeah, ride on. Can you climb up here? Magnemites are Boglands exclusive? Bang. Well, because I definitely caught Magna... Ma Magneton? In the Coastlands. I think Magnazone as well. But we'll see what else we got. Because I think that's the only... Uh, Space-Time Distortion exclusive I'm missing. Ouch. I wish Steelix would just, like, leave. I want other Pokemon. I'll just catch them. I don't know if I need them, but it's to do something while the game is waiting to, to like let itself be fun. I just wish you could trigger these things. Why can you not? <sighs> oh no. 5 FPS Steelix. Don't piss him off. Oh, that was sick. We need a berry. Never enough Alpha Steelix. That berry's gonna despawn. Actually, oh, he's about to despawn. Um, um, uh, geez, get him! Ah, dang it. Too late. What a tease, bro. That sucks. <laughs> oh, normal Sneasels are in the first area. Uh, I don't remember what it's called. What's up, big waifu sent? Uh, were you here when we caught Palkia? Because we caught Palkia. <laughs> we did that. Oh, creatures. We also fought the Mochi Man, which was, it got a little hectic. Oh. Alright, you're all annoying. Um, you can get caught. You can get caught. I don't, I didn't remember when you left. <laughs> get backshotted. It's about time to go catch Dialga, but I was like... That's a lot of you. Yo, did you see him just turn around and show his ass to me and then teleport away? That was crazy. Okay, dude. Ugh.
I'll be back. <laughs> Porygons are... Mirelands. They're Moisty Mire. Ah, uh, I remember. Did you get your video done? Uh, ooh. I, I need Octillery. Like, they're not even rare, but I need them. So... Like, and I have so many Eevee. Like, I'd rather have an Eevee than whatever the hell this guy is, but I need him, you know? Oh my god. What the heck? It was crazy that he just did that. Was that Hyper Beam? That was nuts. Alright, but I will take the Eevee. He's just a little guy. Oh yeah, I wanted shards. Oh, I'll take another of you. You're, like, pretty rare. You're sticky... You're sticky glob-worthy, to be honest. Octillery are scary. That was crazy that he just did that. He just did that. <laughs> What is that? Oh, that's the evolved form. Get him, get him, get him. Sticky glob. Ultra ball. I hope that caught. If not, I'm gonna battle him. Let's go. That's hype. Saves me some work. I've got enough Jolteon. <laughs> And by enough, I think I mean one. I could use another Jolteon. Uh, um, 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 um. Get him. <laughs> Eevee, you're old school. You're old news. Ugh. Are you aggressive? Oh my good god. Get me the hell out of there. Yeah, evolutions are cool. I mean, it's a cool gimmick. It's definitely a cool gimmick. Alright, anything last minute spawns? Anything last minute? No? Okay. Yeah, I know, those dudes are crazy. Um, what? Did we pick up a satchel? Oh, someone got one of our satchels. Grit rocks? Hmm. Not a great satchel, but I mean, hey, a star piece is very good in grit rocks. Decent satchel. Thank you. Thank you, Miguel. Sick. And I don't ever want to fast travel ever again because I could fly and potentially find a shiny, so we'll fly up here. And get our Dialga. Oh, you guys are annoying. <laughs> See ya. I must try. <laughs> oh, let's go. If that, if that would work, that'd be crazy. <gasps> let's go. I finally got it. Are you kidding me, dude? Are, uh, all the times... All the times I've snuck up on that dude... <sighs> How many gigaton balls have I thrown at that dude while he was eating a berry? I just dropped down on him and got him with an ultra ball. Uh, whatever, dude. He has eluded me. Oh my god. That is crazy. This game is stupid. This game is dumb. <laughs> sure. What the? Oh, there's a bunch of them. 
I wish that you could get these dudes earlier in the game, because I would put them on my team. I think they're cool. I like the typing. Grass electric. I think it's fun. I should be using great balls. Oh. Okay, okay. That's not the right. Out of here. That is so stupid <laughs> that that worked. <laughs> the origin of everything, exactly. Uh, now we're going back to Jubilife? What? Why didn't I just meet... Uh, what? Okay, okay. Yeah, we needed to tell the professor, I guess. You don't have walkie-talkies or cell phones. Well, only I do. <laughs> hmm, I could make a Master Ball with this, probably. Time for whatever we're calling that stone. It's an Origin Ore. Rallet is just bullying, absolutely. The Stone of Creation's beginning. Ah, uh, the Diamond and Pearl Clan coming together, and Galaxy Team turns them into a vessel. It's... a Master Ball? It's gonna take some time. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, Mr. Professor. <laughs> Excuse me, that was a hiccup. Half hiccup, half burp. I'm starting to expect all of you, your paddling about the value of time as a cover for your own impatience. If sitting back and waiting actually saw things, I'd sit forever, because I'd be using time well, unlike this. It's awkward. <gasps> We've done it! The Origin Ball! What? Okay. Okay. Mr. Professor is funny. I questioned why he was calling him that. <laughs> What if I just threw this Pokeball at like a Bidoof? <laughs> that voice is speaking in my mind again. Why is it talking to her? <sighs> Appears that Mighty Palkia is willing to lend its own strength to us in battle. I hope the game doesn't make you put it on your team. Take the origin ball with Palkia, head back. It doesn't make you put it on your team, does it? It doesn't seem like it. That's good. Yeah, why isn't it a master ball? I don't know. Ooh, do we take Rotom? We could take Rotom, to be honest. I think we take Rotom. Now, do we want Grass Rotom or Fire Rotom? I guess Grass Rotom. See you, Raichu. Yep, back to survey work. Now we just need to load this dude up with some grit dust and grit pebbles and whatnot. <laughs> Oh, that is true. Yeah, Master Balls were invented by Silphco. Get out of here with your lore and reasonable explanations. That's, that's cringe. Where are the candies? That's what I need.
Six large candies, that should be good enough to get... Yeah, we, we got enough candies to get them up the snuff, I think. Oh. Oh, wow, a bunch of max revives. Oh, yeah, we want to get our dirt, our dust and pebbles. Could I? Oh, we don't have that much dust or pebbles. Ich. Ich. Okay. Let's unload this boy up. Hit him with the dust. Oh, special attack, of course. Boost him. And then what? Probably speed. Bam. That's it. Crobat can take one. For speed? Hell yeah. Uh, that wasn't even a level up? Uh oh. He might be under leveled then. Yeah, he's a bit under leveled. He did master a move though. What move did he master? Yeah, I definitely made a good call putting points in special attack and speed. Ooh, X. Oh damn, he knows thunder, huh? Is there any reason to have, like, Shadow Ball over Thunder Wave Hex? I can't really think of any. Besides the fact that we're about to learn some Grass-type moves or something. I don't know how Rotom works, actually. I actually have no clue how Rotom works. <laughs> at all. I assume we just look at and inter interact with this? Yeah. Okay. Choose a Rotom? Palkia can't enter the motor. <laughs> this guy. Ew. Leaf Storm. Oh, won't let me toss him out right now. You look kind of gross. <laughs> oh, he's so tiny. Why is he so little? <laughs> I thought he would be like the size of the lawnmower. He's so small. How little is refrigerator mower? That's so weird. Well, let's teach him leaf storm, I guess. Oh, wow. That's really strong. That's really strong. Um, yeah, fuck Thunderbolt. All right. Let's go with my underleveled Rotom. I guess I could give him rare candies. I'll just give him the rare. I at this point, like we're we're almost done with the main story. I'll just give him the rare candies. Just a little creature. Eat your candies, you grassy creature. There you go. Very good. What do you want, lady? 
I'm starting to get hungry. I, I kind of want to finish. <laughs> and here you are, lost one, ready to face your fate atop Mount Coronet. Yes, I'm going. Honestly, I kind of want to order food. It must weigh mightily on you. Not particularly. You have friends, your allies, and most importantly, your Pokemon. I don't know what food I want to order. Or if I want to order anything. Now, hearken to my... Her hearken? Hearken to my words, young ones. Ouch. Time not cannot be severed from space, or space from time. The being you will encounter... At the Temple of Sinnoh is Diaga, ruler of time. Of all time. If it is allowed to run wild, time... <laughs> this is like the big part of the story, and I'm just looking at my phone ordering food. Um, I guess let me pa pause real quick and do this. I'm not like splitting my attention between the two because after I'll, I'll order something that'll take a while to get here Mr. Beast Burger who I don't know dude I saw pictures on Twitter of people that ordered Mr. Beast Burger and it like it looked horrible but also I don't know if they were real it could have just been people like deciding you know, fuck Mr. Beast, we're gonna tarnish his brand, you know? It's hard with stuff like that. You don't know which, what's real, right? That's how I look at it, though. I don't know. I feel like people just lie all the time on the internet. For fun. Okay. I got a cheesesteak and fries. Oh, do you have to get a drink with it? Uh. Choice of combo. Am I gonna fries on Dr. Pepper? I'm sorry to pause this dream for this, but I'm absolutely starving. The food lore is going crazy. <laughs> Do we like cheesesteak? Dr. Pepper? Are we Dr. Pepper, Pepsi, or Coke? I love it. Dude, I... <laughs> I like pause the game during like one of the most pivotal cutscenes. Like, hold up, I need, I need a cheesesteak right now, dog. Been here in Husui, and I get some fries with that. Eventually, the very world may be broken, but you have the aid of its counterpart, Palkia, the ruler of space, and therein lies hope. Balance will be brought to time and space, and the world can once again be as it should. I'll take Palkia and make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. Is she going to make me take Palkia, dude? I don't want to. Oh my god. What? You have to sit through this whole thing again? That whole thing? If you don't have Palkia? Oh, it wasn't that long. Okay. I guess it just felt long because uh, I spent 10 minutes ordering food during the middle of it. Who do I replace, dude? I don't want to replace anyone. Ugh. I guess Floatzel. It serves the... Either Floatzel or Gyarados. Gyarados is probably stronger. I don't want... Pal I hate that it's forcing me to take this. 
Like, I'm not even that connected to my team, but, like, imagine you're one of those people that, like, forms a real connection with your team, and then it's like, hey, yeah, fuck what you want to do. What? Uh, okay. Yeah, I have Palkia. I have Palkia. I have it. Three times? Yeah, okay, this is quite the intriguing village. Perhaps I'll have a look before I go see what your cloth clothier the clothes shop has. Excuse me, is this the time for shopping? Yes. There's hella helicopters flying around outside. <sighs> All right, Jamie. Once you feel ready, set out. AJFM, you missed the the big Uber Eats order. <laughs> We're getting a cheesesteak with bacon cheese fries. Shopping while the world is ending. So was I. How can I talk shit, dude? I was ordering a cheesesteak. <laughs> like, all right, yeah, the gods of time and space are are having a. a or pitching a fit. Your beard from profile is fucking beast. It's long, dude. It's long. Can you switch out Palkia from the mountain? Ooh. Good idea, dragon. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want the Uber Eats to arrive too quick because ideally I have the game beat by the time my food gets here and approximately 40 minutes. Ooh, I don't want to be like, I don't know if I want to eat on cam because I'll probably be like chewing gross. I actually need to... Uh, I've been about to, to shave my... <laughs> the, the potato mochi's coming. <laughs> uh, man, if the if the Uber Eats dude just came on a braviary, it would get here so quick. But no, I've actually been considering shaving my beard. Because it is getting... Ooh, cringe. Okay. I'll just take this wood. It is getting too long. Like... What's the pause button? It's getting too... What the hell was that? That was my Switch controller, dude. Could, uh, could I potentially just make it full screen? Probably. It's, like, really long, dude. Like, I think it's probably the longest it's ever been. Or second longest it's ever been. I'm practically at the final boss. Shh. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Have you considered that, uh, <laughs> I've been fucking really slow? <laughs> I've been practically at the final boss all stream, dude. Ooh, final out- ooh, mass outbreak, ooh, mass outbreak. Ooh, space time distortion, ooh, Uber Eats. Oh, Alpha Steelix. I'm still kind of salty about that Probo- Probo Bass. <laughs> Probo Bass. <laughs> That shit was crazy. What the hell is that? Is that an Alpha Dusknoir? Turn around. I turn around. All right, that's the turn around strat. I don't have time to worry about Alphas. We like we actually got to get going. Unless it's a shiny. Get the hell out! Get go! Get get the bird. It was a glide score. Eh. What? Oh no! The green's back. Oh, oh, oh. Have you 
check if there's any outbreaks. Don't tempt me. I swear to God if the mochi man is here again. I also want to keep an eye on my food. Just the girl I've been waiting for. I know you can buy various sundries at the base camp, but I thought it might be helpful to you if I set up here, closer to the temple. I want to have front row seats if there's a chance to see into the world of Mytham... Legend. I think my headphones just like had a glitch or something. There's a weird sound. <laughs> Maybe that was part of the soundtrack, but it was very off-putting. I'll probably be creeping even closer to the action once the battle actually begins. But you won't have to worry about me. Yeah, nothing at, that I'm saying at all is uh, menacing whatsoever. I'm just going to be creeping in as you become more and more vulnerable, and I know all of your Pokemon. I know everything about you, and I've been following you the entire time. I've also been doing research into all the lore on my own, independent of everyone else. But don't mind me. I'm just around every corner. Uh, you seem to know just when and where to best combine the strengths of humankind and Pokemon kind. Bring on Pokemon that is willing to aid you. You caught the perfect one of the temple's. Dragon, I blame you. <laughs> I blame you, Dragon. This is your fault. Okay. Maybe that was actually a uh, fast. That was actually a good strat. Oh no, do that. Okay, okay, dude, okay. Yeah, just put this piece of shit back on my team. Get the fuck out of here, Floatzel. Get him the hell out of here. Send me fast travel. Dra I blame Dragon. Dragon said, yeah, just take it off your team. <laughs> it's okay, Dragon. If, uh... <laughs> I thought it would I thought it would teleport me to the one like directly outside of of the place I went into but no it said what Okay it said actually we're going to send you to the one that's as far across the map as possible instead of you know the convenient one sure I get it if my food gets here and I have to loudly chomp my lips into the microphone, that just is what it is, I suppose. Get off the, the goddamn wall, Sneasley. <laughs> cool. Why are you acting like that? What? This <laughs> is new. It's new dialogue. I know you can buy various sundries. Yeah, I got it. I don't want it. <laughs> yeah, it's an ASMR stream. Ugh. Mukbang. <laughs> Poke Mukbang? That's branding. Get up there. Ugh, that's so dumb. Why, why, why does the game force you? For so long, I thought I had to eliminate any outside element that might threaten the people of Jubilee Village. Had to check the clock. Whether that meant banishing you or seeking to destroy the Pokemon in the temple, I felt it was my only path. But you've shown me that I was wrong to think in such a way. <laughs> yeah, he's just a, uh, you know, um the most menacing uh, and suspicious character that ever existed. I'm sure Volo's chill. Are you sure? Are you ready for this challenge? Yes. Jamie. I, I guess, yeah, Palkia, having Palkia on the team makes sense for lore. Jamie, in all of vast space, your place has found you. It makes sense for lore. I get it. What in the world does that mean? 
So Pearl Clan saying, It reminds us that occasions we must rise to are also stages where we must prove ourselves, where we might shine our brightest. So basically, you're saying to not feel nervous? We're starting to see the appeal of how you Pearl Clan people think, in some situations, anyway. Did they end up dating? Are they, they're, they're a ship. They're ship bait. We will support you. Though I doubt you need it. Protect Hisui and her people. Protect time and space for her Pokemon or something. <laughs> oh. That's what Cynthia is, was too? I don't know. <laughs> I know that the, the timer on my food just got lowered by 10 minutes. <laughs> so we, well, we chucked the ball in the cutscene. He is just Cynthia, literally, I mean. Wasn't Cynthia like she she was she was Elite Four, right? I'm not a fake Pokemon fan, I promise. Oh. That's why you need Palkia, huh? <laughs> it's my grass Rotom! He tanked the hit! Oh, it, it's the weird version now. The version that is like unanimously hated by everyone. Yeah, I never finished a Gen 4 game. Oh, it's it's like a noble battle. Um Okay, he's he's moving up on me. What's the timer on the on the Uber Eats? Yo, they're picking up the order. Okay. Oh, this this is a jam. Oh, this is so good. Is this was the time god right? And I'm fighting the the time for my Uber Eats order. This is kind of crazy. We need to defeat it before the Uber Eats order gets here. Did I? Oh my god, it's so intense. The f the flames, bro. Okay, let's go. I'm laser focused right now, bro. We're gonna die. It looks like it swallowed a toilet paper roll and it got stuck in his throat. I didn't notice it. I didn't notice it. Okay. Arriving at 310, it's 254. I don't mind them. I honestly... I think Palgi and Dialga are kind of ugly already anyways. <laughs> Is that a hot take? I think that their base forms are not that good. I think they're... They're not horrible, they're just kind of mid. I think that the I think that this uh I think that this uh this game does like these kind of boss fights really well. It gives you the option to reset if you want the extra challenge, but like since babies are gonna play it, they're like, hey, you, you can keep all your progress. And I'm a baby. Oh, okay. I'm especially a baby in this moment. You suck, you rat. All right, come on, come on, come on. Like, two more. Oh, that was a good snipe. Oh, let's go. Let's go. I'm glad you're having fun, big wifey sump. Ooh, wait. Oh. It lost all texture on his legs. Yo, it is so hot in my room right now, you guys. I am drenched in sweat. It was cold when I started. I'm wearing like pajama pants. I'm wearing a bulky hoodie. I am drenched in sweat.
God acquired. It just got lowered again from 310 to 305. Well, we fixed it. Is that the end? Is that the end of the main, main quest? <laughs> Caught the god of time and, and the food... <laughs> the food time got lowered, dude? This is pretty. The song. Also, the cutscene. The, uh, all the pre-rendered cutscenes do generally look pretty good. She caught it. She really did, didn't she? My eyes aren't lying. We've seen common theory of the mimicry of Ar Arceus led to the alteration hindrance of their own powers. Hmm. Interesting. She actually went and caught it? Person detected? Is my food here? <laughs> no, it still says 305. Eight minutes, okay. Good show, what a catch. You contain that fearsome thing in the origin ball. Absolutely astounding as ever, Jamie. Finally. Just what I expect of my pro today. Literally shut up. Oh, he's getting emotional. That's cute. So even the commander shed a tear now and then. Never thought I'd see the day. Yes, what a sight to have witnessed. Hmm. Oh, do you toss him? <laughs> Ouch! What gives, Commander? Well, at least it seems this is no dream. Oh! Listen up, all of you. We faced a calamity unlike any we have known, but we were able to overcome it by working as one, Calamity Trio. This calls for a celebration, a festival! Gather your clans, this will be the greatest celebration who has ever seen. Two clans together, huh? <laughs> well, since it turns out we are both following a true almighty son of our own, I guess the times when we fight over who was wrong or right are ancient history now. The Denny's Hobbit Slam? The the Grand Slam Burger? Yo, that shit kind of fire. I'm sure our ancestors would be shocked to see us agree, but this may well be the best path forward, protecting the space we all share. Let us celebrate. For today, dawns a new day for all those who live in the Hisui region. He said the word calamity. JFM! <laughs> the title of this stream is Finishing the Main Game, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, I hit the mic. The hat. This is the name of the stream. <laughs> we looked longingly at it. Isn't that the name of the stream? Oh! That was it! <laughs> Can you skip this? Can you skip the credits? <laughs> yeah, the credit music is kind of a jam, though. Justin is taking care of my order. Coming in hot on a piano. Man, I keep hitting the microphone. Uh-oh. My Uber Eats driver has been driving since November and has only done 14 deliveries. It's kind of scary. It's like truly a gig driver. So let me go once every week and a half. Oh, that was cute. I love that Lilligan. And her. Super cute. Yeah, I mean... Uh, what are what are its flaws? Cutscenes that drag on and pop in, and the visuals don't look that great. I mean, sure, not not huge flaws. I feel like I'm not really playing for the story, anyways. Oh, by the way, Uber Eats hack. My cousin used to do this. He would order food from a restaurant and then uh, pick it up on as a driver on Uber Eats and go pick up his own food and get paid for it. Like, it didn't cover the food, but it made the food cost less. That's a pro strat. What was my favorite moment in this game? Probably catching all them hella shinies. What was it? Last stream or the stream before? That was a good stream. 
I had a lot of fun that stream. I'm looking forward to getting into the... <laughs> it's huge IQ, right, dude? I'm looking forward to getting into the post game. There's, what, eight more missions in post game? I think I've heard. I would say that definitely didn't feel like the end. That was pretty anticlimactic, right? Or is it just because I was thinking of Uber Eats the whole time? Is it my fault? I don't know. We'll see when I watch back the VOD. <laughs> but you definitely know that there's more. I mean, it's called Legends, Arceus. You didn't you never saw Arceus? Kind of odd that the final battle isn't a Pokemon battle. Not that odd. Now you can get all the legendaries. Ooh, okay. Okay. Damn. How many legendaries are there, I wonder? <laughs> Still have to fulfill our divine mandate. That is true. We need to max out the MF Pokedex, you man. What did I just say? I was like gonna say man, but you know, and it came out as you man. Post game good? I've heard the post game is like the best part of the game. I kept going into caves every time, even though. Aw. Boo! Let me let me take the picture. Boo! I don't like that. Come on. Why would you not let me? Why would you not let me take a pic? Why would you not let me take a screenshot, dude? Your arc phone is beeping. Seek out all Pokemon. Okay. Oh, well, we got Dialga. Oh, we have to go back to the temple again? Oh, a new day dawns. Okay. All right. Well, that was a... That was a good stream, you guys. Thank you, everyone, for coming by. I hate to end so abruptly, but the food is, like, at my door. Um, uh, we got a minute. I'll let it run. Uh, that was Pokemon Legends Arceus main story. We barely got it done. Um, yeah, I tried to fix my theme up, and then we never even, uh, used it. Um, <laughs> in that final battle, that is kind of odd now that you mention it. Uh, I didn't really register that, but that certainly is weird. Hmm. But yeah, I mean, it feels, I want to give my thoughts on the game. Oh, by the way, this is a cool detail. I like that you're barefoot and then you get your shoes on once you come down here. I do like that. But yeah, I, uh, I love this game. I think it's probably the best uh, Pokemon game ever. If not the best, it's certainly high up on the list. And I don't think that's a super hot take. I think it's a very good game. You can go first person. <laughs> and look at a lawnmower. Ain't that the coolest shit ever? I'll catch you guys next time. I'm going to go eat my Philly cheesesteak. Yum, 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 delicious.